Bro, 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 check it out. It's the brand new Find Everything 0.2.0 update. Check it out. Uh, this came out a couple of days ago. Uh, as you may know, I streamed... What the... Huh? <laughs> what do you mean out of date? What do you mean out of date? Whatever, find everything. I'm playing this for real now. There we go. Oh my god, look at the server sites. Man, fuck this mouse! Tyler, you know I love this game so much and I will sing its praises to, to high heaven. I, the mouse lock thing makes me so angry. Uh, anyways, yeah, there's the materials. There's like the sky. I was a little afraid for a moment. Um, but let's see. Where am I on this list? I have 130 things. According to, what is that, Columbo on the front cover? There is, there's almost double that now. Oh, look at this. It shows you credits for, um, who made the music. Speaking of, let's turn that up a little bit. Because I had this super quiet, uh, for my own LBA purposes. And now, uh, now we'll see what's up with this. Top is tippers. Oh, that, this is Robux. You can give Robux to the game. Yeah, this is gonna be good to reacquaint myself with this. Because I've been looking forward to- This update has been teased for, like, the last several weeks. And every time it get What the fu- Who is that? Straxdos? Wait, what the- 215 things? You already beat this whole damn game. I'm going in here. This is this used to be like a, a normal house. Spawn Hill Credits Theater. Well, Griffin, give them Robux. They should give me Robux. What the fuck is this? Uh-oh, cats. Sploinky Bingle Catastrophe 5. It's a whole new Bingle for Sploinky. January 43rd. Oh, my Bingle. Look at what we found. <laughs> SpongeBen the movie. <laughs> Who made the art for these? <laughs> I didn't realize that I was looking at it for a second. He's like in Marmimo world. It will be so awesome. Another one. Thing, comma the lorem ipsum. Cool. Wait. <gasps> okay. Wait. No, I'm onto something here. I was just here because I love the developers. I want to find the developers. But no, there's like a reason to be here. Whoa! Yeah, those guys! Those guys are the coolest in the world! And I gotta eat the movie popcorn off of the floor. Wait, there's like a sit down prompt. Wow. Whoa, and it scrolls! Look at all these cool names. Additional art animal! <laughs> Wait, is it a thing? I think I can pick that up. Wait, are a, a couple of these things? Shock hearts! Interesting. Okay, there's a couple of reasons to be here then. Man, I love that. I love that find everything. Statistically, probably the most spilled food of all time. Find everything starts to impart in you certain kinds of impulses where it's like, th there's no way that's gonna like be a thing. And then you try to get it and there's like, a special anti-thanks! <laughs> Wait, so yeah, I have to stick around and get seven of these? Is what's, is what's going on here? Wait, come back! Oh, no. Hmm. Thank you so much. I'll come back here. I'll come back here as- this. That can be like the last thing that I get in this update. But there are other places to go for now. You guys have seen the names once, and you will see them again, and probably many more times, because they make more than just one cool thing. Large beverage. Root beer with red licorice straw right here. I made the sponge bin and thing the and sprinkle binky posters. Socks did the superhero movie. That rules. Right, and that's where the, the red brick is. It all starts with this. So what's new? Where is there to go? What's like places? Okay, I wanted to go to this coastal city over here, but that's still locked off. So, perhaps it's quicker to ask, where can't I go? Um, yeah, I think all of the, the work in possum walls, the other ones that I can think of, are all off in this direction. Like, near the town and, and like, the dump and stuff. This fountain looks a, a bit new. Oh, look at this! This is a really interesting approach to how you did this. It's like a, like a 2D scrolling material instead of, instead of being beams. Fascinating. The reflectivity on this also looks really, really good. Find everything has so many good meshes. Wait, are the sewers open? 
Maybe the sewers is the first thing I should do. The thing dex lets you hide found things. Lemon? I'll bring a lemon. Can you go in here yet? Oh! <gasps> maybe I always could have gone in here and it's like definitely not new. Happy home. <laughs> oh, that's good. The welcome mat. I don't know. This doesn't really seem that familiar to me. The race car bed? The arcade machine? The weld texture on everything? The game is stuck on screensaver mode and the joystick won't move. Sewers aren't open yet. Literally unplayable. Use? Free poster. Zoo fun! Oh, can you change the channels? You know, it's just the one. Yeah, dude. <laughs> These sound effects. You know, have a look at the thing decks for a second. Because all, all of this used to be, um, kind of ornamental, right? And now you can, like... Oh! A button! Pumpkins, black hat, candy mascot, chirpies, oh my god, detestable crow, dino nuggets, fire virus? <laughs> oh, I guess that's another thing that hadn't occurred to me. I could just, like, I, I was immediately going to start asking about new areas, but I guess, like, I could revisit the existing ones and they'd be, like, a little more fleshed out. It's a neat miniature model of something. It's Crossroads. Seems like there's nothing you can do with it right now, though. Okay. Ew! Oh, it's a toilet! I didn't notice! I hope there's, like, stuff to find in there, because I kind of just, like... There's cute things to examine. Ow! But I think it was, like, normal in there. Mario block? Hello? Does it work? No, it's just sleeping. Don't worry about it. It's had a long day. It can't make everybody go sideways all day long. Straxto's found a fly. Well, I think I found fly before, right? Hmm. Injured? Not my problem. Yeah, let's go to Yippie City first. Wow! Oh, look at this new sign! That's got some pizzazz. Yeah, dude. <gasps> the doggy cars! Fuck yeah. Man, I was like begging Tyler to ship that in the first release and I was so bummed when it didn't make it in. God. Whoa! <laughs> oh no! And also it explodes. Screegus Cola. Finally. It's whole. Oh, this is the house mesh from before. Wait a second. Oh, telephone on top! You don't think. <gasps> I know this name. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. The Yippie City Phone House. Okay, we got numbers, we got a phone. Yeah, what can I dial here? Oh, okay. It's like, um, voting for maps in, uh... Super Bomb Survival is that the dialing is very, like, intentional. The squishing of these is very good. It's gotta be four numbers, so zero nine one one. Whoa! Cool scrolling checkers. Number not found. I can I have the player list? Okay, I getcha. If I type in 6969, do I get banned from the game immediately? The dump in the woods are also hugely different. Hello, 0911, what's your problem? What do you mean you're finding everything? That's illegal, people can't do that! Okay. Um, how about 1-800? Shit. The rotary phone with a digital display. Hmm. I think I have to do the crime now. <laughs> what is this? 
Whoa there. Please read this document frequently. All concerns are terms and conditions. <laughs> 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 Oh, man. Find everything's got some good bits. It really always does. Maybe there's something up on the rafters. <gasps> oh, there totally is. Oh, it's a phone book. Let's see here. It's an old phone manual. Chapter 12. What not to call. While using your new cellular phone may be fun, you must beware. There are forbidden numbers which violate our terms and conditions as read in Chapter 4. Forbidden numbers must never be called, no matter what, because it's rude. For example, one must never call the number 2000 plus 30, math used for obfuscation. Those who dare will be punished swiftly and forced to reread our terms. 2030? 2000 plus 30? Well, I don't see anything inappropriate about that number. What could possibly go wrong? Maybe I'm just bad at math. Oh. Oh, oh. Don't touch me that way! You're so in for a treat. This update is like 75% bits. I'm gonna recollect the terms and service. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Mm. What, if I, what if I put in like a year? Right? Like a year. Okay, nothing. How about 2001? Tyler's favorite thing in the world is 9-11. Number not found. Can you imagine if he is actually... <laughs> I'm just like looking at this wire going into the phone. Oh, if only there was a credits house to tell me who made the wonderful meshes in this game. Um, how about 7777? Or like 1313? Never not found. Yeah, let's try 1313. Whoa! Light bulb physics? Cool. God, this max tune is so hot. Number not found. Are there like other places to find clues to like put numbers in or is that pretty much, I already like got the one thing. Like are there, are there lots of different numbers you can do to find stuff or is that pretty much like already solved? This could be another thing I can come back to after I like explore a little bit more on the rest of my adventure. The doggy cars. Yippee! There's a handful of Easter egg numbers. Okay. So we, we do have some work in possums here still, but uh, no, yeah, this section of Yippie City is like all brand new. A doggy treat. Whoa! The barking. There's definitely more here than last time. Once you go like further into the outskirts, it definitely did get like more barren and visibly unfinished, but this is like, a love fountain! One out of six pigeons. Whoa! Doggy's here as well. Wait, you have my bone! Dang. Is that- can some doggies just be like random? Or is that like- that one's always gonna be on that route? Or maybe different doors go to different doggy places? I feel like there's more grind rails around here than there used to be as well. To this man, I hate you, and I hate your stupid sunglasses, and I HATE THE KETCHUP KIDS! No, it's okay, they always come back. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Did I get this? Yeah, I think that's like a recyclable can of some sort. Uh, it came from this corner, didn't it? Doggy? <gasps> you. Watch, it's gonna come this way. But it's mine. Maybe I have. There's like a like a passenger button, like a pedestrian sign, and then I can make the doggy stop. I don't want to like go over it. Ooh! Oh, look at the coloring on these stairs. Such a fun little detail. Weenie reviews. Find everything's got like characters in it. Slowly but surely. The Sonic the Hedgehog Mephos. 
What's a super cool internet gamer number? Oh yeah, I guess I could like put like, I guess uh, 1337 in here. That's eight, Griffin. I was given this checkpoint for a fateful reason. Hello? Dude! What's up, man? Welcome to the Lead Gamer Hotline! Hi. Can I help you learn something only Lead Gamers would know? Okay. Okay, listen closely to my words, heed them well. You can phone one hidden thing. You can find one hidden thing. The Elden Thing in a Mountain. Also, you can find cool obby in some... I thought 9 was G. Eggs. In some eggs in the dump. And okay, that's basically everything I know. Thank you. Now, go young gamer. I believe in you. Bye bye. How do you read this so well? What can I say? I was born and raised. It's my native tongue. There were like one or two words that threw me for a loop, but I guess I guess it could have been worse. <laughs> oh, they're all like toting bones. <gasps> There's like different kinds of dogs too. This one's like got spots on it. Yum! Oh, this is splendid. Yippee City is really coming together. And I thought it was pretty damn fun to hang around in earlier. This seems new. Oh. I get the sparklies challenge. Ow! Watch where you're going. Oh. Oh, you're like collecting a batch in like a timed period. Okay, so far so good. How long is this sequence gonna go on for though? If I get it wrong, there's consequences here. so close to going away. Oh, a USB stick! Oh, and it's got the dog on it. Warp drive for Yippee City. Cool. I guess I didn't have that before. I also saw that there's like some new signs over here. Erm, um, the IDK store. Non-enterable storefronts, buttered dogs. Oh, that's where you are now. Well, now I know. That was just kind of hanging out in the middle of nowhere previously. So I gotta knock more of these over. <gasps> Are these all dangerous in like different ways? Whoa! Whoa! I thought it was just gonna tip over like the last one. Well, there's another screech his cola down. I don't have all the dog treats yet either. <laughs> A crab! Like, this thing is hauling ass. I've really got to, like, work to get this single doggy tree. The other ones are so normal. Yes! Oh, you can just roll on top of them. I thought you would, like, get hit by it. Is Leet speak a lost art among the younger generation, or are they still in on it? I think the younger generation... The younger generation is coming up on TikTok where, like, all swearing is banned. So you'll notice this, you can always tell when somebody is young and from TikTok when they, like, censor words like kill and die. Like, not even swear words, just like, words that TikTok would find inappropriate, but are otherwise, like, normal to say. Whoa. The Yippie City Construction Zone! Well, this is a good place to start looking for things. T. Thing letters. <gasps> H? We're getting somewhere. What do you think it spells? Oh, there's the I. Look at the colors on this. The yellow and orange. Oh, that's all that's up here. 
I thought that was gonna lead to like like a whole like cool like tower climbing sequence. Oh, excellent! This is already like a like a really f good feeling area to play around in. I wonder if I can get on top of this somehow though. Man, I don't know. Towards the end of Find Everything, there definitely was. Wait a second. Ew! Poor de piggy. Sorry for hogging the potty. Give me a break. <laughs> oh, not that sound. There was a point where I did feel like I had mastered the move set, and like nothing could stop me. I was finding some weird ways to get to things that I don't think I was like able to get to. And it felt amazing, but I don't know if a couple of months later I still have the powers. Oh! Construction zone warp drive, cool. There's the end. Oh yeah. Oh! I gotcha. Truly, here is nice grind rails. <laughs> Okay, you know, if that's what you want to make it stand for, go ahead. Did I go up this? Whoa! No, this is going someplace else. Oh my god, the destructibility. Oh, this is cool. This is like exactly what I was asking for. <laughs> Man, it's all coming back to me though. The movement and find everything really is something special to Marvel. Oh. Oh my, climbing is a cakewalk. <gasps> who are you? Oh my god, who are you? Carpenter Mouse. Can't you see it's my lunch break? Oh, and then that spits me back out. I wanted to get like the one solitary star that I missed. I feel so sad about it. Um, the funny thing is that uh, kill and die aren't even censored on TikTok. It just makes your content less favorable to the algorithm. So people will censor it for views. I see. Uh, what other dumpy things can be found? I don't think I've been up there. There's like purple ooze coming out of that. I don't know what's going on up here. Hmm. I think I have an idea. I'll reverse off of this. Oh! Yes! What the hell is this? What, the, the entrance to Blackrock Mansion in LBA? Uh-oh. A work and possum area. Well, I can't turn back now. There could be things here. Unless none of this is complete yet? No. Because there is... That's like a jelly wall right here, isn't it? And then you can do the things that you did and yeah, this is a section all right. Oh, cool! This has already got shit going on. I'm into it. I'm so into it. I don't see anything off in this direction, but if I follow the trail, I do see that maybe this is the path. Yeah, okay. Here's the rest. Whoa! The bouncing isn't, like, proportional to the height that you fall down from. So sometimes I expect to be launched higher than I am. Whoa! Oh, do these, like, give you diagonal bounces now, though? In real time as they tilt off the ramps? Hmm. I think rolling onto these would be good, because then I'd keep the speed. This area only has one thing so far. All right, I'll keep that in mind. Oh my god! I bet I would. I bet I don't even need the bouncy pads. They do kind of like move you to the side a bit. Neat. Whoa! Yeah, these might move a little bit. 
too fast for their own good, I think. I'd like to utilize them, but... Even when I am, like, over top of them. I guess the point is to use the double bounce to, like... Milk more... Well-timed opportunities. Like, if a current platform isn't it, you can just, like, kind of... Buy time till the next one. I don't know. I, I want to get them on midair so bad. But I guess that's more on Roblox than it is, you know. Things will fall the way they want to fall. Let's see if I remember how to tech roll. I want to do a tech roll onto this. Yes! They shouldn't have made things that look so tempting to jump on. There we go! What the... Jelly Jelly, it's a Puyo! Yeah, this is new too. I, I like that you can see when other people find stuff. That's cool. Oh, there's gonna be a whole rest of this, isn't there? Aww! is this place? I'm thinking of something on the scale of like the eggs obby, for example. This is like really not messing around. This is like the size of Yippee City itself, it feels like. All just to find some jelly jellies? Uh-oh. Oh, okay, you can recover though. Fascinating. Yeah, speaking of find everything ha having great movement, though, is that with 2.0 comes the opportunity to, to, like, now that the player base that so many people have found already, like, hundreds of things, that you can start to, like, kind of ask more of them in some more difficult sequences. Um, this is very satisfying. The, the first little bit with, like, the moving slimes I wasn't really into, but this is right up my alley. Oh. Yes! The angry jelly. Uh, is there anything that I missed? I kind of... went about that in a bit of a strange way. Is that a thing? No, that's just, like, two railings coming together. I don't see anything on these towers. I think I'm good. I think I'm good for this section. This actually feels like kind of, um, an LBA-ish area in the way that, like, there's a central area and then each mission kind of, like, spokes off of it. It even has a, a boot-out system! Wow! These are the things from the dump, but you don't climb them, you jelly them now. Very fun. The scale in this update in general is amazing. Yeah, find everything's sub areas from, from the 0.1 release. Um, we're all very fun and impressive. And getting to find more of those will be a big surprise, because I was definitely, like, a lot more... I feel like involved is probably the wrong word. I'd like it to be the right word one day, wink wink, nudge nudge, uh, when our guest area is becoming a thing, Tyler. But, uh, I definitely saw more of the 0 0.1 of Find Everything as it was coming along. I had much more of an idea of, like, what to expect, what I was going to find. Not for everything, but certainly for a whole lot of it. Um, with this, I've kind of been deliberately trying to avoid that and be like, I, I wonder what kind of surprises I can kind of savor for myself and discover when it comes along. 
but Griffin, you have an LBA to work on? I don't know, man. LBA doesn't have a moveset like this. I'd love to get my hands on something like this and see what I could do, you know? LBA doesn't have fucking grind rails. Come on. You can understand a poor man's plight such as mine. LBA has got plenty of cool enough gimmicks going on at the at this very moment. But nothing that's like actually impressive. Like stuff that's like that anybody could do is what's an LBA. Find everything gimmicks is like how did anybody on Roblox even like figure out how to do this? What if I don't use the jellies at all and I just go straight for the balloons? Okay, checkpoint. Got it. This calls for a tech roll, I think. Oh, that's glass! No, it's not. It's a normal wall. So that's just the end of the sequence? There's no extra, like, skips? Okay, we're good. Whoa! And it just gets bigger still? Wow! Oh, this lower area is awesome! Oh my god! I didn't know it was gonna go that hard! Whoa! Little chemical plant zone with these guys. Uh oh. What is my way back up? I genuinely forget that this is in the Roblox engine most of the time while playing this game. Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty astounding. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait a second. Erm, um, I take everything I said back. Because these trusses, they aren't touching. Right there, you see? It's consistent all the way down. And then when this blue thing gets out of the way, look. There's a gap. They don't touch here. Hey, now we're talking! Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I'm a dummy. There's a much easier way to cross. There's a little swing for that purpose. I was trying to do it without. Oh, this makes so much more sense. Okay. No, I'm on a roll now. I just hope I'm not missing anything with those, uh bounces in the central area. I guess maybe this is like a speedrun tactic, but you don't have to use it. Because, uh... I'm compelled by it. It does, like, sound interesting to do. I just don't think I'm, like, at all good enough to do it. Maybe this is, like, supposed to be a late game area that you come to. Like, it's maybe not the first place I would want to visit after being gone since, like, what? 2022 this came out? Okay, so you do have to do this for, like, the ending, though. That is the conclusion. Oh, shoot. There was the last guy, too. Griffin is such the kind of person to know what a truss is called. Yeah, because in Roblox, you can just have truss objects. They are two by two by two, and you can stretch them on one axis, climbable surfaces, and they fueled very much of what you could, like, you know... Nowadays in Roblox, you can do anything, but... Back in the day when Roblox gave you like a new bespoke toy to play with, it was like, it was like God invented like a new kind of animal. And he's like, he just like showed up on in the world one day. It's like, well, I'm, I'm not gonna like not be curious about this. You know what I'm saying? Guys, I don't have all the jelly jellies. Something is wrong. I don't think there would be another one down here. I think that would be foolish and reckless. And it would be foolish and reckless. Ah, oh, yes, my favorite animal, the wedge part. That's right. That's exactly right, it's Porter. 
So there's, yeah, there, there was one at the bottom, two this way, one up here. And I think that makes four. I guess there was a fifth one somewhere. I think there were two up here that I already got. I'll double check for a fork though. Mm, I think these roofs are safe. Uh, oh, I didn't get this one. Oh, very simple. Whoops. Wait, if I die before touching that checkpoint, I might be able to try easier. My favorite animal, Zeke and Luther. From Disney XD. Man, and all of this just for one thing. It's so sprawling and expansive. Gotcha. Nice combo. It literally is. It just literally is. Uh-oh. Can't even leave normal. Uh, how do I get out of here? Okay, that's this. Yeah, down here. Man, I bet this is gonna be like five other things to find if you go in those pipes. I'm a little afraid of it, but I can leave and go back to the construction zone for now. Cool place! It's so funny to me, anyone who was there has that weirdly specific collective memory of the Zeke and Luther event. I kind of wish that things like that were able to still happen, you know? Because I feel weird that like I was around for it and now they just do and now it's like normal. Like what if they introduced like union parts and there was like some like weird collaboration? And every time you make a union, it has like a fucking Stranger Things logo on it. What the? Keep our workplace safe. Learn more. Three, four, three, three. Hold on. I gotta go back to the phone house right now. Three, four, three, three. Oh, and the last dog treat. These smell like gasoline. Oh yeah, I was talking a lot during Mario Kart about um my trip to America. The the place we were staying in, the, the washing machine smelt like gasoline. And you opened it up and there was like like a black a, bu a bunch of big black stains on the inside. Don't know what was up with that. Hi Chops Triggers. Uh phone house is this way. God these kick panels are so hot. Isn't it near here? There's the phone house. I want there to be a groundbreaking new feature for developers, but you have to go to Walmart land to unlock it. Whoops. Okay, safety, learn more. What, what's the secret? Hello, you have reached Safe is Awesome and Follows Everyone. How can I help you? What? An unattended crane? Oh, spinning support beams? Tell me you're joking. There's a giant truck suspended in the air? Well, I never said that last one. Grind rails without guardrails? This is unbelievable! A steamroller driving around flattening people? Our team is being dispatched now. I'm at a loss for words. That sounds like the most outrageously fun place to be! Thanks so much for letting us know about this little slice of paradise. It's nice of them to have put a phone number for narcs in this game and then you call them and then they have fun. Uh... So I'm gonna find the, these next two vending machines. There's Laundry's Mat. Yeah, these are these smell like gasoline. Yeah. What are other doggy places I can go to? Is there really a truck up there? Can you go in the pizza place? No. That's still a normal door. I don't see any crazy trucks. Oh, wait, I thought Puppy said Pibby. Oh, I guess that one is, but it's like, I don't know, it's like average. Unless you can like activate the crane somehow. Hold on, what is this attached to? 
That is, hold on, I am able to climb that. This is like another fork from the, the rail stuff. This is a good clue of things that may be to come. Ho oh, ho! Oh. Pull it. What the? Ew! Truck freak. <laughs> so the legends were true. Let's see, there's a thing for a key here, but I haven't seen a key around here. Is it like in the construction site or should I find that elsewhere? Maybe I'll hang out in the dump for a little bit. Wait, this is different. Oh, cool! The instruments are like old Roblox sound effects. What is this? Oh! Oh! Oh, I think, Tyler, you showed me this. This is a cool gimmick. Ho ho ho! Yeah, this is another really cool thing to have, like, figured out how to do in Roblox. The cosmic clones. And it's like, like a novel, like, twist on them. I'm into this. Are these spikes, like, a little more gnarled looking than usual, or is that just me? Oh my- this music is Paper Mario Origami King as fuck. Oh god. Help! I gotta build some distance for a little bit. This guy is hot on my tail. What? Oh! Oh! Oh, it's a person! I thought I could, I thought I could collect them. I'll always miss the old dump track, but this one is hot too. I mean... Hey, I th wasn't it just like an instrumental of shirts and pants? This has got a lot more going on with it. And the little bit where it's like the Roblox bomb ticking is like extremely good. Yeah, I'll, ta I'll talk to you first before like starting any fights. Hi. Um, are you busy? Can you raid my place five stars? Please? Aww. You're adorable. Let's burn you. <sighs> okay, good. Man, this is bizarre. This has not, like, ever been a way I've had to be asked to behave in a Roblox platformer before. Oh my, what is going on here? This space is crazy. <gasps> you gotta light that damn torch. I don't care about the stars. Okay. Another one up here. That's four out of six. And then, oh, it gives you like little indicators of where the remaining ones are. That's handy. And also impressive. Got it. Uh it's this- oh, it's the fire script! The virus! Of course. <laughs> you got owned. Oh, I remember this! LBA1 definitely, like, still has that virus in it. Like, I'm not joking. Are there other things to find here, or is that just, like, the one thing? Because there's usually two, to my recollection. But I could also be wrong? Everything around here seems to be, like, purpose-built for the torch, so if I'm wrong, I'm wrong, and I'll find out later. But I want to see more dump stuff. Refill my health for a little bit. Wait, yeah, there's more of these, like, little, I guess they're, like, toy boxes. Oh! These, um, these came with, like, the, like, the plastic Roblox toys, right? Like, if you bought, like a, like, a Super Bomb Survival toy, for example. I think that's what these are, like, a reference to. Oh, 
Well, this seems pretty unassuming so far. Is it in a big egg skybox? What the? <laughs> Hello? Bush, see also cloud. What if other things can be interacted with now? I'm not gonna be satisfied. I don't know, it's probably just one thing per place. I am if you get squashed by the purple smiler. <laughs> you can TP to a secret world. But you didn't hear that from me. Oh wait, yeah you did. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, there's something about Find Everything that I really love, where you can stumble into a place and it, it's like this huge sprawling goop factory, and sometimes it's like a, like a little toy box. There's just one small surprise. Okay, we still got some working possums around here. Although, it seems to have been elaborated on a little bit more than just like, like a big, like, string of tape. This cliffside's got a lot more atmosphere going on. I'm always so impressed by the meshes in this thing. Aw oh, man, there's like a cool hotel level, but it's also locked off. Hotel. Oh my god, this scary font. Typeface. I promise I used to be normal about always saying what a typeface was and what a font was correctly, and only recently have I started saying it the wrong way like everybody says it. You should talk while being chased and look at the fire guy. I can do that. I think? I don't know if they come back. Oh yeah, they're back. Of course the noobs gotta be hanging out in like one of the more difficult places to access from the jump. Although there are like different ways of getting around. This is a little bit easier. What? <laughs> Just reading a newspaper! Does it does it say anything? I see yippee yippee times. Okay, but the, the dialogue is the same. That's an adorable detail. I sure hope the fire doesn't chase me out of the box. Help! Okay, there we go. I was kind of half worried that, like, if I gave it enough time, then the fire, like, would eventually find me. Let's have a look at the, uh, the thing decks for a little bit. What do we got here? Creatures Gaming. That's really good. Uh... Oh no, is this from the fucking Angry Birds movie, who pees? Oh god. Well, okay, let's sort by locations. I want to, like, find more dump stuff. Okay. There's not too much- Heart? Noob stress ball. Cloud. Okay. I feel like I've heard about these, like, Thwomp guys before. I forget if I've seen this or not. Let's try it. <gasps> the Noob Den? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is it? Like their legs like spin a little bit. Oh, freaky. Okay, thanks for the advice, little noob. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and all the, all the parts are only like green, blue, and yellow. Oh, wait, this is like cool obstacles though. Oh my god, this music. See, there we go. Is there anything back over? Oh my god. Noob eggs. Oh! Oh, it's got an egg. It's like a noob eel. 
So this thing like laid all of these. Oh! <laughs> it's got the McDonald's face. I gotta get that thing. Freshly laid. My little noob hen. God. This is freaky. Did find everything need like a minotaur? Oh, wait. Noob stress ball using case of emergency. Okay, okay. This explains a couple of the things that I was still missing then. It was like just in a sub area. Oh, come on. I'm gonna have to wait for that thing to come to me, aren't I? Ten of these is a lot too. Okay, there's six. I guess the stars are a good help though. Where I have and haven't been. Um Yeah? Oh, Okay, 8 out of 10. This is good. 9. I just came from here. That was a good save. Good dodge. 10. Okay. Mammalia monotraumata. I need to fucking escape now. Oh, it got me. Got me on the way out. That's okay. It was a shortcut. I really want to hang out with the guys that are just, like, walking extremely normally. This is how characters in LBA still move, because it's on R6 and not R15. Oh, man. Very authentic skybox, too. I love looking down and seeing- I can see, like, the individual, like, JPEG pixels. I don't think it tops Marmimo World necessarily, but it's it, it's pretty damn good. I can't tell if this is like a glass cube or not. No, I can just go in normally. Oh, there's keys though. So I guess this like happy home thing is a final like location. There's three forks and then I come back here. <gasps> just like Roblox Adventure 1. Oh, wait a second. That replaces your your rolling and I assume your air dashing, which is um, there's like some uh, adventure game prototype that Tyler had that had like pick upable and liftable and throwable objects in it that kind of came with like a similar stipulation. Uh, and I sure thought that they were cool. Please use front door. Why is this like so authentic? There definitely is like something sparkling back there. Cool. Sword fight on the heights, of course. Oh. I always like stuff like this, where sometimes the challenge is in reverse, where it's it's easier to get to the end, and then you have to go back to the start, and like that's the actually hard part. Ugh. Whoa. Ow! Don't step on my key. Okay, two out of three. The walking is so, so good. And it looks like you were just able to use the same stuff that's a part of the, um... Like the puppy cars and the train behavior and all that. And you can just like make a person out of it. That's neat. Oh, oh, you drop it when you get hurt. Man, that's really impressive. Whew. All right, what's inside? Oh! oh! Crying noob covered in bugs. This will surely make a great thumbnail for my 2009 game. <laughs> I 
thought it was gonna be like the normal inside of a house, just like a fucking like scary dingy cave. <laughs> Alright, this is good dump progress though. Let's take a look at the thing decks. Um Dump high found. Okay, so there's only four things left to find. Cloud, fly, game of fries, and heart. Which means I guess I think I said that I found the fly earlier. I definitely did not. Do I have to go back to the John Gamer Fry's obby? Wait, that's also new. That's also new. What is this thing? Arlo? Elmer, the monster with a heart of gold. Is this literally Roblox Arlo parody? Use giver. Oh, that's cute. It's, uh, <laughs> oh my god. Man, they really don't make games like this anymore, do they? I gotta go for the face. I gotta go for the face. Oh, I understand how it works. I thought it was just like wherever you click, but it's wherever this is pointing. Oh. Ew! Wait, there's like something like inside of him that like fell out of his head. Something's happening there. Oh, gross. Well, yeah, there's like stuff in him. I'll just, um, hold on. I gotta, there's only one appropriate thing for this. I'll just, uh, I'll just put this in the corner. And he can watch. I don't know, it's like full of- yeah, like spikes or something? What if they made like an actual like Arlo plushie that you could ow that you could go and buy and then you like squeezed it and it was like full of like tiny sharp things like this. What? Is it was that the heart? Anatomically correct beating heart in Arlo? It still pulses with love for his family. Ew! It's got like a meat shader on it! It blows my mind that you'd still prefer to hold right click after all this time. Yup! And I'm not changing a bit. Wait, can you rocket jump with this? Oh, cool! That's a fun way to get around. Sorry, speaking of old habits die hard, I'm kind of like... I know I got the thing that I needed, but I'm just- yeah, I need a little more time with this. Like, literally until there's not a trace left. I mean, you can also use, um, just sliding around on a trackpad with two fingers to do it. But then when you do, like, the dumb lock, I don't know even how to relock it, like this. Like, this is, like, way too sensitive for me on a trackpad. I think maybe if you're, like, using a normal, like, mouse that's like detached it's nice but it's like way way overkill for me on, on this like setup like is that on purpose wait you what what do you mean i what i lots of things Roblox has a mouse sensitivity option, if I recall. Yeah, mine is like normal though, right? Yeah, camera sensitivity. That's what that is, right? I don't see anything separate for like the mouse. This is as I like. Can I take it with me? Do I just have this now? Nah, it's gone. What a fucking crazy thing to put in the dump. Okay, so the John Gamer Fry is obby. Oh yeah, I don't think the eggs used to be up here before either. There's definitely some stuff that's gotten shuffled. Wait, there's the fly! It's like buzzing around Arlo. Hello, my stinky sweeties.
We can put this away now. Guys, I don't, want, I don't know what I'm gonna do that Pikmin 4 comes out like tonight. I could play it after Find Everything if, if there's like enough time. <gasps> I gotta swat that thing. I gotta swat that thing out of here. But I don't know. This is feeling to me like it's gonna be like, it's gonna take me four hours to find all the stuff. So maybe tomorrow night. Come here, come here. Come on! Look at the little like, up and down wavy pattern that it has though. I am consistently so impressed by the stuff you've managed to achieve with this constraint based movement system that you can just make custom paths for things. Bzzz, dies. Like, I've really never seen anything like it. Anything, like, as sophisticated as this. Another one of these. Whoa! Huh? Huh? What? Did it just do wall jumps onto the roof of that building? No, I gotta find a way up there. Oh, there's more pigeons, too. Wait, door? Yeah, that's normal. Wait, no it's not! I can go in it! <laughs> I look just like Squeaky Holly. Math.sign, baby! Yeah, I don't know- I don't know her. I'm sorry. More work in possums? Yeah, what's going on here? Christ. There are so many more of these pigeons still left to find. Let me take a look at my warp drive locations. I'm pretty sure I have the one for the construction site. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Uh, have I been to the big smiling sun? I wanna go there. I haven't really like looked at the rooftop areas very much. Because I kind of just assumed I already found all there is to find, but I... You know, that's a big assumption, given all the other new stuff there is to see and do. So there is this. See, there's like a castle and stuff? What am I talking about, dude? Oh, I can just do this. Oh. What the? Oh, God. A timed barrel challenge? Oh, but it goes to the sun. No, it doesn't. Oh, that's what this is for. Onion ring. Oh, the onion ring, the onion ring! Is there anything down, like in the base of the tower? This is like a very themed building. This is where the um the crown used to be, right? Yeah, I don't see that around at this point. It might have been removed altogether. Is that a pigeon up there? Hold down right click constantly. That's what I'm doing. I know I don't have to. This is what it looks like when I don't hold down right click. This is what it looks like when I hold down right click. Like, it's a little more sensitive. But it's not like un unwieldy, like I think the default camera behavior is. Let's see. So the answer is no, that doesn't go to the sun. No, I'm not falling for that again. 
That's the one that explodes forever. But what the fuck is this? <laughs> Horse, isn't this like didn't you weren't you were used to be able to like see this in like some sort of like I think it was an area that was going to be like a farm like off in the distance. That's a really funny way to commemorate that. Wait a second, lemon. Oh god, where did I see this? Oh, it's like a thing plant. Is this like in Thingsburg or, or what? Um I don't know where to take this. Probably through traffic, right? Every seed has a pot nearby. Oh, there's like more than one? Uh, oh, I guess I'll go back where I found it. Of all the inspiration to take from Odyssey, I, I, I don't know. You could have done without this one, I think, maybe. Uh, it might be across all of this stuff. These little, like, oh, the outcroppings! Okay, well, now what? I don't know, I'm, I'm so used to, to using the shift key for all sorts of, like, forward propulsion movement tech. With Mario Odyssey, you still have, like, a really fast default run speed, and so holding things didn't feel like it impeded that. This does. When I say nearby, I mean obviously nearby. How obviously nearby are we to- I found it like in here, didn't I? Or no, there was like a big pile of dirt. Hmm. Maybe it's near the statue. Right, you can make like a garden here for a horse. Yeah, the donut shop moved a little bit, too. Huh. If you leave the alley, you're too far. Oh, is it, like, behind this? No, that's... That's normal. If you leave the alley... My guess is that it's up through this stuff. That's what I think. You can't use the e you have to throw it like this. I guess that's fine. It's a pretty predictable arc. Oh god. I'll scout it ahead. This could not even be it. Oh god, it definitely is it! Oh! I don't know about this one. I'm a little bit afraid of it. Oh, okay, but it's over though. It's over. Whew. Oh, wow. Cool animation. Stitch Turnip. It's got 30% of your daily recommended vitamins. And the last pigeon too. Often called flying rats, because both rats and pigeons are very cute. How's Yippie City progress looking, then? I don't think there's too much to find in the area of the dump or Yippie. It's organized alphabetically. Hide found. Oh no, there's a lot to find here. What? Scuzz floppy ear? And also Screegus. No, there's there's lots more. Boss emoji? I never found the cloud or the gamer fries. I could go back to the obby. But I've been to the obby before. Is there going to be new stuff to do there? Or do I want to do the sky needle, which is definitely where the, you find the needle. The sky needle is one of those things in find everything that's like, I feel like more of a mythical landmark, you know? Like, it's been, it's been, like, one of the sub-areas of all time that's been long-awaited even since 0 0.1. I think it makes sense to go to the John Gamer Fry's obby first and see if there's anything to do there. 
Yeah, wow, the dump has really changed. What do we got here? I don't know, this kind of looks the same to me. I think it, it looks like there might be like more fan art, but that's about it. Oh my, well, the, the stars used to not make that sound, I can tell you that much at the very least. Another one of these. I wonder what, I wonder what that's about. Oh. Man, I already, I already did this too. Tyler, is this where you get the gamer fries? Do I have to do this again? Who's drinking? Someone's drinking in my ear. Oh god. It's like a very tall platform, so I keep thinking as long as I like knock into it anywhere, when I look at it at a steep angle. But doing a wall kick, I'll just get up there easy. But the answer is no. Things have changed. <sighs> okay. Oh, checkpoint. Nice. Somehow this lava feels higher res than it used to be. being better at this, for sure. Yeah, <laughs> I remember finding that. Wait. Some of these things are clouds, but there's like more than one. It has like a mesh. But I can't rule it out. What if it is a thing that I can find? There's no way. It's just a normal cloud, I bet. Oh my god. I can't even see what is and isn't safe. It's raining tacos. What is this art? Cool. The wide balloons. Oh! I guess you gotta go like out and around. Griffin, I'm gonna save you the trouble. I thought the same thing and none of them are the cloud thing. Okay, thank you for the advice, It's. That's good. I mean, the clouds have been here before. Oh, these. This is like, these are tight ropes. They, they, they're not meant to ever have been this mean. Oh, there's just nothing down here. <laughs> just in case you want to do like an extra hard route, I guess. Weird big question mark of a route. But that's the spirit of these, what? <laughs> The Roblox bass noise. Wait, that's cool fan art. Oh, there is definitely a new John Gamer Fry section. Oh, what's up, man? It wouldn't be a true obby without, without opportunities to ask yourself the question, why is that here? God, this fucking thing. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna look down at the ground for, for this bit. Oh, ew! <laughs> you gotta leave these damn stars alone.
I do like that bit, but I think the bears are a little bit quiet compared to everything else. Now it's gonna make me do the these sounds again. God. But where are the flat spinners? It's over there! There's a flat spinner. I guess it's more of a, what's the word, a flat oscillator? <gasps> okay, so then this is the thing that gives me... I got that already, and then it was like a grind rail that used to go down to the bottom, which is still here, but also... And then there's this. What is this, like a bounty sandwich? Oh, you climb it, you climb the sandwich. They make nom 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 noises? Wait, there's text on that. The thing that I said was cool, there's text on it. <gasps> oh god. And I thought that the part that I had already played through, that that was mean? Everything after that has the excuse to be like even meaner if it wants to be. Oh, those are bad. Those will like detach me. Spinning red swords? The hell is it? Ew! <laughs> Ew! Gamer fans don't just give up without fighting. The gamer fan 07. Why is this like raw as hell? It looks like cool Homestuck art or something. Oh God! What is happening? <laughs> the sounds. Aw, oh, man. Well, I'm a gamer fan. I don't give up without fighting. I'm going right back in on those, those sandwiches. Oh, but you have to do the whole thing in one go? Harsh, dude. She flattened my spinner till I... I don't know enough about Roblox to finish the joke. She flattened my spinner till I win the obby. Till I win VIP. Okay. Oh, okay. This is so, like, very confusing to my senses. Like, it's all on the same plane, but they're all going in different directions. Also, I, like, won that, by the way. I got to the top, and then I just, like, went backwards. I could have committed. Nom, nom, nom. One more loop. There it is. Ooh. Who's- which sick bastard's idea was it that looked at the John Gamer Fry's obby and said, You know what? No, not good enough. Let's do- let's do more. Let's add an extension to it. What? <laughs> wow! <laughs> the John Gamer Fry's! They tried to get rid of me. Why is it- this is like- there's a lot of frames in this video, it's very smooth. Wow, that's very impressive. Jacuzzi. God, this rules. The cars! You can't drive them though. Wow, very bouncy. Guys, what am I talking about with the Sky Needle? I never want to leave here now! Oh my god! Well, that's one way to get back to the start. I kind of understand now. I kind of get why it needed an extension. It wouldn't have been the same without it. Okay, so Cloud. It's- I think I could use another clue. And I haven't got a clue! Is the cloud just like out here in the dump overworld? Or is it like hiding in a sub area like the John Gamer Fry's obby? Because I think if it's just like out and about, I'll find it pretty quickly. If not, there could be a problem. Give 
Okay, that's where the USB was. Uh, type A much? Your arch nemesis is holding it above you. My arch nemesis, Arlo! What, like if I go here, then it's like at the top? Oh, you're right! Oh, you bastard, you sly bat! Look at this smug dick. He knows exactly what he's hiding from me. See, also Bush. I wonder, it's kind of like a thought bubble, right? I wonder what he's thinking of. And according to the thing decks, that should be like 100% dump completion. So that's 155 out of 220 things. Location, the dump, yup, that's everything. Cool. Epic waffle path. Okay, so we can X that out. I think it's time to go to the Sky Needle. He's thinking of Griffin in a blender. No! Yeah, dude. I mean, come on. There's nothing that commands a presence quite like this. I guess I should talk to this guy. Well now, but a eh? not too close. You stand before the soul crunching the most soul crunching challenge in all of Yippie City. The Sky Needle. Yeah, I know. Pshaw. <laughs> Someone like you can't get in though, not without a ticket. Let's just say you'd be better suited to <laughs> Super Fart Baby Adventure 3. <laughs> Pshaw. <gasps> Whoa! <gasps> Fun Bill! Good afternoon, citizens. And establishment. Ahem. Hello, Mr. Mayor. So then, was Austin bothering you? Gaffar! I was only warning our guest here about the dangers of climbing the Sky Needle. Ah, Towers. Need I remind you of the promise I made to Yippie City? That every day, no matter what, things can be cool here. For everyone. And things are cool here. Right? Oh, give me a break. The Sky Needle is cool so long as we keep the uncool out. <laughs> Sheesh. Dog idle animation is so cool. Ah, uh, it's my understanding that you've never reached the top of the Sky Needle, despite owning it. You aren't gatekeeping an experience, are you? Tower climbing is a skill that should be honed, not appropriated by all diaper loving babies. Reaching the top of this tower is difficult, nay, remorseless. Even for a master such as myself. Furthermore, the Sky Needle requires a ticket to get inside. A ticket far too expensive for non-professionals. Nah, I don't buy it. Orson, you sly slug. You got a ticket lying around. Where is it? Humph! <laughs> if a dirty sewer baby like you wants to climb this tower so bad, I threw it in the sewers the other day. I seriously need to draft up some laws about throwing things in the sewer. What do you mean the sewers isn't in 0.2.0? This is like the perfect tease. People live there, you know. Sorry about that, Blockling. I think I know how you can get that ticket. Here, take this key and go to the storage building near the Thingsburg Gym. It's a blue building near What's It Woods. Keep an eye out. <gasps> the storeroom key. Wait, there's like a quest. I can't go to it right away. There's like a build up to it. I'll keep my eyes peeled. So there was there was that, and there's also like still. It didn't look like a normal lock. It was like kind of like a car key, I think, over near the um the construction zone. Yeah, I can't do anything with this yet. I can't. It looks like there's like a twisting mechanism. I don't know. Maybe there's like more to climb. Actually, there definitely is more to climb. Hold on. I kind of threw in the towel once I got to like magnetizing that truck or whatever but that's really close to like the top of the crane what happens if I just like keep going up past that right like, there's there's got to be some sort of like tech that I can do uh, or maybe not looks like they're kind of on purpose simplifying the collision so that it doesn't work yeah, if there's a key up there, I'm not seeing it from where I am, but good to know, I guess. 
Wait, who's the user literally named chat? That's not... That's not for me, is it? Is that based on Molkar? Yeah, Tyler has been, like, very forthcoming that uh, they really like Pui Pui Molkar. And it's like, yeah, we'll make the doggies in Yippy City like that. And I think it works. I think it's a, a very, um... Fun flavor for a platformer in particular. Oh, this goes to the um, yeah, the waste facility or whatever. I gotta go back to Thingsburg. Basketball hoop, and even this gets to be like a crazy mesh. So it's near the gym, blue building near the gym. What's it, Woods? I do see a door. Whoa. Speaking of places that got an overhaul, that doesn't look very much the same at all. They're 1000% right. Tell them they're right. Tyler, you're right. Oh yeah, wait a second. I think I've been here before. What the? Outlet. Weird. These have safety features. <gasps> Storeroom key. Well, what was in the cracked thing first? Because this was not the way it was b before. P -p 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 paper! Need paper! No! Open thing decks. Oh, God. Um, my d gym degree? <laughs> thing stolen! Oh! Woo! <sighs> was that the fucking sound of Tyler that Tyler likes? Oh, but we're all good. That's much better. Oh, sorry, you can have your paper back. I just need some reading material. Great, now it's sopping wet. I truly appreciate your help. It's a cold, dark world here in the toilet zone. Here, you can have my treasure. It will greatly enhance your capabilities? Oh! I guess it is near the gym. Guys, did you, like, introduce another move? Ew! Kidney container! No, thank you. I guess it is like that Majora's Mask quest, isn't it? I should have seen that coming. Smelly sewers. Oh, Thingsburg maintenance tunnel? Maybe it's like, like a sewer sub area or something. Oh yeah, it is! There's like other zones you can see from here. Oh, what a tease. At least you get like a little bit of a sneak peek of the music here. Cause that's- the music for the sewers has been like done for a while. Oh god. It's okay, I understand what ha what I have to do here. Do I want to hit these things, maybe? They kind of give you like a knockback though, that's a little unpredictable. I think it's better to go around. Oh, here's what I can do. Like that. Whoops. Whoops. Nice, okay. Oh, what is this? Under and then like this? Jeez. I appreciate that that's a thing that you can do in Find Everything, but it's a little daunting, I'm not gonna lie. And I guess maybe that's also a kind of learning that you could apply to like the earlier areas to get through it faster? I don't know. I don't know if, I, I don't know if that's for me. I think my problem here is that I'm, I'm taking too long to recover the height, and then by the time I need to use my air dash out of the roll, it's like I can't like get it back. Yeah, you, you can just jump out of it earlier and then you're good. Sky Needle Ticket! And there it is, there's like the exit from the sewer, which I cannot actually use. I guess this is fine.
be dauntless, please, streamer. I'm dauntless! You think I'm full of daunt or some shit? Not me. And you guys gotta make sure to keep an eye out for, like, other kinds of numbers. Explain the daunt to then. No. Not my problem. It looks like I can find another, like, thing seed somewhere nearby here as well. Apparently they're, like, really close by. Oh, here! Over here, there's dirt. Ain't that what they clean the ducks with? No, that's water. <laughs> Aw, happy flower. The page turned and the things Burgians grew happier. Also, hold on, I have an idea. I burned myself in the chimney. What if I go in the fire? What? Thing get third degree burns? <laughs> okay. Good instinct, I think? I don't know. It's hard to tell if I should be congratulating myself for that one or not. Whoa! This is different. Secret little cave of hitting things. New sub area? Thingsburg. Kicking with kickstands. Oh, it's all about these guys. This is like a fun early area. Oh, this guy's got a great character design. Wall kick will. What's up? It's me, Wall Kick Will. The knowledgeable. Plus, awesome! I know a few things about kicking walls. Want the details in a tutorial like fashion? I mean, you're so cool though, I feel like I. Uh huh. Okay. I guess I gotta find a key here first. Whoa! Look at the, the glass shader on these, like, rubbery trees. Cool. Oh, is this supposed to be like a, like a whole sequence or something? How was I supposed to get up here? Probably probably just by like learning about the- what the fuck? Dino Nuggets 1 out of 4? Hold on, hold on. No, I gotta do this normal first. Why is the texture on that so real? That's freaky. Yeah, this is like a cool area. I don't want to end it right away. I guess that's why he's like a dinosaur. No, I gotta escape into the dinosaur world! <sighs> oh, interesting. Yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to think of a better find everything character. I think th that cool of a design is uh, a little bit wasted, I might say, on the fact that he just gives you tutorial information. one more of these little guys. There we go. We're back! A dinosaur's meal. Oh my god. I wish I could say that I feel somewhat vindicated that somebody else has seen that awful, awful movie, but actually I don't, because it means that someone besides me has also suffered in the world. checkpoint here. Oh, you again. I guess that checks out. Beyond this door, a dangerous fire demon named Cal has been captured. Please don't release it. That would be really bad and scary. Where is dino time? Even if you really needed it to light stuff on fire for something, please don't. Management. Wall Kick Will can do whatever he damn well pleases. I just think, you know, other characters get to do more. Oh, there's eight of these? Oh, man. Did the sky just turn red? Whoa, yeah, the colors here just got, like, a lot more intimidating. Am I making that up, or did that really happen? It feels, like, hotter here. The 
used to air that movie all the damn time on HBO Family. It was either that or the sissy duckling immediately after Crash Box. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. I think the sissy duckling is better. Like, I think one of those definitely would have done something for me if, if it had been there for me as a kid. And then the other one is We're Back a Dinosaur's Tale. And I grew up with it, and it didn't do shit to me. Okay, that's five out of eight. Man, these indicators are so helpful. I'm, like, still shocked that it's a thing that you managed to get working in Roblox. They're, like... It's on screen like this, and then you look away, and then, like, it pins to the edge, and there's, like, an arrow. Like, it's so elegant. Like, there's lots of games that have that, but in Roblox? How? Oh, I gotcha. Nice. Fireman. There's 985 reasons to love this guy. Hmm. I guess that's everything here. That's a normal amount of stuff to find, I'm pretty sure. Whew! Fresh air again. Let's take another look at the thing decks. Oh yeah, the- ew, what the fuck is the ew? What is that? Thing mite. This curious critter loves eating flavor text, usually straight from a thing dex. Wow, that's adorable. Well, I hope it stays put. Cringe blue jay. God. Let's see. Wasn't I almost done with Yippee City? No, definitely not. I'll go to the Sky Needle and then come back to that. Like, that's, like, the biggest landmark that I haven't done, and then it makes it to, like, work backwards. Out to lunch. Wait a second, yeah, there was, like, wasn't there, like, a guy here that, like, would tell you secrets based on, like, the number of things that you have? They're just, like, gone. That, you know, I'll say it, that was another, like, cool find everything character. I'm a little bummed that there's just, like, not anything new from them to see. Uh, yeah, I don't know where that fourth vending machine is. The only ones that I am seeing right now are like, I've definitely already done them. Probably on a roof or something. Probably in the Sky Needle. Well, hey, looks like someone found themselves a Sky Needle ticket. Rub it in Orson's face for me. Yes, even though it was just in the sewers. So, just to be clear here, the Sky Needle's a really tough challenge. You'll need to use all your movement knowledge to get to the top. And on top of that, if you fall, you gotta start over. But I'm sure you can do it. You've got the look of a real finder about you. <gasps> like the Mac, the Mac app icon? Hold, can I summon that right now? Hold on. If I just like... Yeah! In the, the left of the dock, the little smiling there. I've got the look of that in me. You're desperate enough that you dug through the sewers? A taxpayer like you would, wouldn't you? Well, go right ahead. When you're ready to apologize for harassing my patience and intelligence, I'll be here. Whoa. Only Glen Gary, Glen Ross fans will understand lunch. Oh my god, Straxdos. 220 things? Isn't that the grand total? Oh, you were 100% in this, huh? All right, let's do this Sky Needle. Good luck, have fun. This seems cozy enough. If it's got relaxing music, how could it possibly be hard? Oh, oh! That, I can't even like see to the top. I think it like turns into like skybox fog before the ceiling even kicks in. Oh, but, but some of it is grind rails. There's nothing to fear. Um. I was like, elevators? Oh, cool! I, I don't think we're getting to Pikmin 4, though. Not with stuff like this still on the docket. I 
Uh, oh, so you want to get like underneath this. You don't want to be on top of it. And then you do this. Oh, the pathing for this is very, very good. Okay. Oh yeah, this is some of my John Gamer Fries tech. I do kind of wish I, I flubbed something earlier because I'm already scared that I'm this high up and I and I don't I haven't fallen yet. Like I just gotta get it out of my system. Uh Okay. Oh fuck this man! You've got to be kidding me! <gasps> oh again. Yeah, just to like give myself a beat to catch up here. Okay, so then it's gonna be that, then a spring, and then balloon, and then I'm back up here. And it looks like if I do fall, it'll just be back here. <gasps> oh, okay. See, that's fine, that's fine. It's not so bad. Oh, there are definitely gonna be sequences that are like, much, much longer falls. Oh, you have to go underneath this now? Oh, that skin is crazy. Is that from a, what, Sonic Speed Simulator? Oh, I can't do the rolling under. Can I do this? Can I do this? Oh, <gasps> wait, maybe I can. <laughs> wait, okay. Problem solved. Why go under when you can go over? He's a natural. Go to galactic moment. I'm not a natural at going under. I'm only a natural as long as going over these walls keeps working out for me. Oh, okay, okay. I don't like that the ground here is like temporary now. Like I, I have less time to consider what I do next. Orson kind of reminds you of that one British stick figure YouTuber. I think I know who you're talking about. I remember that guy used to be like really popular on Reddit, but I guess he's not anymore because I haven't heard about him since like 2015. Okay, you go around. Fuck me, you go around? Or you go over. Uh-oh. I think I've been outsmarted. <laughs> no, I haven't! Making me go around or over shit. fall. Okay, okay. Wait, where do I go? Oh! Oh my god, that's the top! I fucking did it! Oh, there's like a chandelier? Did I really just do that whole thing without falling? Good luck, have fun indeed. Oh my god, the view! This is this is the skybox for Desert Dunes in, a, in Log Block. Look at these cool sky effects. How do you achieve this? Is this beams or did you do something else? Is this like another like math thing? Oh, wait, hold on. The celebrating is a little premature, I think. Cause uh, at least down here, if I did fall, there's like, you know, I could like land on some kind of platform. This is, um, I think this is like all or nothing now. Why do you look like that? Well, I'll follow your lead. At least the little yellow indicator isn't so bad. Tyler, by the way, I definitely need that for LBA before it launches. If I can just like yoink that from whoever made it, please and thank you. Oh! <laughs> okay. We move on. What else is there to do but to move on? God, I can't believe, I can't believe I squandered a lead as good as that. What the fuck, man? There wasn't even a thing for my troubles there. The game doesn't even regard that as like an impressive feat.
So, uh, what's been going on with you guys? Anything interesting in the last little while? You guys excited for Pikmin 4? You guys are probably already playing Pikmin 4. That's been out for an hour now. Um, did you guys see that they're making a horror movie based on Adam Ellis, the BuzzFeed cartoonist? And there's a trailer where he gets trolled by people on Twitter. He's like, I'm gonna troll them back. You guys excited for that? Hey, so here's something interesting. Um, so a couple of weeks ago, I was planning uh, on finishing my playthrough of Metroid Prime 2. And I was trying to turn my Wii U and it wasn't like getting any video out from it, but the gamepad still worked just fine. I'm like, hmm, that's odd. Like, I guess I won't be streaming with it, but I can at least use the gamepad for like my, my own personal use, if, if that's what I want to do with my time. And after, after I went on vacation, after we all played so much fucking Nintendo Land, I'm like, yeah, I want to come home. That's going to be exactly what I do. I'm going to fire up the gamepad. I'm just going to play some Donkey Kong's Crash Course, and I'm going to use this new knowledge that I've learned now and apply it to my existing Nintendo Land save file and reach new heights than I ever have before. Um, but then I actually, like, tried to, like, launch software on it, uh, and I, I got, like, like a memory error? Like, something about, like, the Wii U being corrupted itself. So, I think even if I did fix that video out thing, it, it's sounding like the problem that I have with this is much bigger than, than just getting an output signal from it. So I don't know what to do with that thing. But the gamepad is still fine. I can still use it as a, I don't know, what, uh, like a universal remote if I want to adjust my TV's volume or input settings or whatever. That's still cool, I guess. It looks so bad, the movie not Pikmin. Well, we'll agree to disagree. Whenever I get around to Pikmin 4, I, I, I do want to... I can feel myself being mean about it, and maybe Tears of the Kingdom not living up to everything I hoped it would be is, like, jading me in advance for Pikmin 4, but there's there's been a couple of, like, red flags in regards to what I want out of a Pikmin game that I, that I keep seeing in every single one of those trailers. Um, and they've been doing some uh, Ask the Developer uh, interviews over the last couple of days that... Um, literally expands upon that in a way that proves me so fucking right in a way that I never thought I would. But we'll save it for when the, I actually play the game. I hope it's good! I hope that in spite of their own worst impulses, they accidentally make a good game. But it sounds like they're going to make Pikmin 2 instead. I got Pikmin 4 early due to Australian eShop shenanigans. Tyler, how many eShop accounts do you have? Griffin wants Hey Pikmin 2. The truth comes out. Like, I already preloaded it, you know? My, my bet is made here. You don't get it, it's Pikmin 2, but awesome. Hmm. What, what was the trick that I did to skip this? I forget, like, how I made that happen. I think it was this and then this. Whoa! Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. I just used all of my aerial thingies. I don't have any, like, anything in store anymore. Look at how low I am! What's the point? What a load of bullshit. Wait, wedge fling time? What are these chatters talking about? Is that like a, like a general technique that you can do with any sloped surface? Or do those Mario World triangles actually have like a like a true hidden purpose? How did I get around those so easily the first time? I'm never getting to the top of this tower ever again. I'm never seeing the the, the light of day. 
of Sky, of World 2 Desert Dunes. Was I going over them? I guess I can go over them. Around is cooler, though. Not so bad. Not too shabby. All right, I'm recovering. Whoa! Well, I was hoping the balloon would like recharge in time, but it didn't. I guess it'd be too good to be true if it did. Griffin, have you ever tried being epic? No, why would I? refresh your air moves like these balloons do by the way yeah I, I i think i caught on to that it's just they kind of interrupt your alignment a little too much for my liking um what is news to me though is that if i don't use aerial moves then balloons will like store your momentum like if you go in really hot you stay hot coming out of it as long as you don't do air dashes and shit so that's the way to do that that's so much more elegant than like what i was trying to make happen oh god <gasps> That was a very lucky save. I guess that's also what makes those things so dangerous, though. Okay. This is why I said that I wanted to get a fall out of me early. Because if it happened later, my nerves would be fried forever. They'd be John Gamer fried. Like, when was the last time I even made it this far, right? I've been spending a lot of time down in the dumps, and I'm not talking about that overworld area. <gasps> that was bullshit. I hit the wall and I didn't get any upwards movement from it. <sighs> oh! Oh! What's the old saying? It would be easier for Griffin to beat the Sky Needle than to get into the Kingdom of Heaven? People who are epic finish the Sky Needle. Well, you should have said that sooner. I'll do the fucking Sky Needle! Oh, hi, Socks. Socks, you should have seen what happened. I literally got to the top of this shit on my first try, and then I fell in the sky, and now I, like, can't get back up. I'm, like, getting stuck on all the early parts. You should have read it sooner. It was like the coolest shit I've ever done in Find Everything. Like, there's never been a better opportunity for me to express my talent, my natural-born platforming god abilities. Oh! And now I, all I do is this all day. I don't think I've been here for that long. I don't think it's been that bad yet. But it could be. It's on the way to it. Socks, what are some cool numbers for the phone house? I was looking at that earlier. I did 6969. I did Leet. I did the safety number. Mac, thank you for the sub. Griffin, if it makes you feel any better, it took me about 45 minutes to beat the Sky Needle. Okay, well, I haven't been keeping track of that, but as long as I can get under that time, I think we're, we're in the clear. 1414. Oh, the Lala number! Oh, I gotta go back like right fucking now. I almost like wanna scrap this run just so I can go to the Lala house. 0001. Okay. I'm glad that I have this now. The phone just like disappears. It's the giant dog head mesh on top. 
I wish I, I wish I knew more about the Lala dog, you know? Like, I bet it has a real name that its owners call it. And it, like, has other things about it in its life. It's kind of a more like a, a 3D dog than we get it credit for. Roblox devs, when they hear Lala will be at the function. <laughs> Wait, maybe, um, Socks, should you be here right now? Um, when I, when I get to the later part after the springs happen, then no matter what, you have to promise me that you're going to look away, okay? I, I do something that I, you absolutely under any circumstances are, are not allowed to fix. Please, for the love of God. Okay, there's no elevator. It's this, it's this. The stars tell me that I have to roll under and then jump out, and I'm really, really bad at it. There was an earlier area, like like a mini, um, what's the word? Like a bite-sized demo of this um, that also asked you to do like under and out jumps, and man, I just couldn't do it for the life of me, but now I go over. Now I go over and everything's better. And it's the only way I can win this. Wait, hold on. <laughs> yeah, but don't... you didn't see it. Please look the other way. Rolling under is way harder. Most people just go around. Oh! Yeah, I guess most of these walls are aroundable. That one looks like it might be a little bit hard to pull that off with. But okay, that's good to know. Um, and also I have another skip, but also please don't fix it because it's the same problem. Yeah, don't. Maybe you can, you're allowed to fix that if you like. If you want to like put ground under there, maybe. Um. <laughs> wait. Betrayed by the skip. The skip would never betray me. I betray me around here. I don't like that this habit of falling that I've picked up is carrying through into like the latter half of the Sky Needle. Cause it leaves it when it's like a bunch of like dumb and quick mistakes. It's like, oh, well at least I'm like already at the bottom. What's the worst that can happen? Uh-oh. Every single one of these falls now though, I'm, I'm fighting for my life. God, and you think my nerves are gonna get bad now? Oh, just you wait. Just you wait until I actually like make it back outside again. Here's what I did. That's not what I did. Fuck, dude. I did it like so thoughtlessly the first time. I was like, I was using one balloon on the bottom to get to the one that's like above it. I don't know what I did differently. I thought that that setup was pretty strong, personally. That time around? The outside is actually the easiest part. The hard part is your nerves. But I have those! I have so many of those! They fire in my body and they tingle. I like how it feels to roll around those, so maybe we'll just move the stars. That would be nice. Maybe it would be nice if you... If there was a checkpoint when you do get to the top. I've got a phone house waiting for me though. I was just trying to get all the things in Yippie City, now there's like stakes beyond that. Although, I guess the extra numbers could also be like more phone house things. I think I only like got the one. That was like the, the terms of service. I don't know how many of the things left on the list are from the phone house, but that's the only one that I remember getting. 
All right, what is this now? Okay, so it's more like, it's more away. I need to like come away from the wall faster than this. I don't have my air dash though, was the problem. I don't know where my air dash is going. I have to become like hyper aware of, oh no. I have to become like very hyper aware of what is and isn't recharged. And then I got to use it in like the, the perfect recipe in the exact right order or I'm not gonna have it filled. Cause I need to, once I use that balloon, I need to dash away from the wall. That's, that's what's happening, that's what's happening. Is I'm using my dash to go, what the? To go into the wall? And then I don't have the horizontal clearance to come back away from it to get the, the second balloon after that. So it could mean that I'm like overestimating how much I need. Like maybe less is more in this case. Like, if I just come out of that one balloon, I already have the height that I need. No more funny business necessary. Alright, nice! Yeah, in the next Find Everything update, you should make it so that when you do try to climb these glass things, there's like bumpers at the top, but they're like invisible, so they only show up when you like, when you try to do the skip that I'm doing right now. I'm playing Find Everything today and it's great! Am I killing my son? Alright, alright. That's what I did! That's what I bounced off of this wall and that gave me the height. We're so fucking back. I really like how the Sky Needle recontextualizes the aerial moveset as a sort of resource. Yeah, um... And I'm a little trigger happy with it, you might say. bumpers, there's no moving platforms, it's just some sticky walls and some balloons, and yes! Okay. And now we're back to this. Now we're back to this. This, uh, this texture is from the... what is it? Like the yarn area, right? This normal map still looks so good. Is there like subtle wind ambience? I feel like it, I, I like hear wind sounds. What the fuck is this? It's not over. I thought I was gonna like do like one rotation. I could kind of see some like some stars or something off to one side. Oh, I just don't know anymore. I gotta take a drink of water. I gotta take a swig. My heart is about to fall so far through my stomach, I'm gonna shit it out. Like Arlo! Okay. I'm sweating so bad right now. I'm gonna tech roll this. Yes! Yes! Okay. Good. Good, okay. Is it the end yet? I think I see a thing on that cloud. No, that's just a blue star. Oh, but I have to use the rail speed off of this, aren't I? Oh, okay. Oh, then it goes back to normal. Man, why the fuck isn't this over yet? I want a checkpoint. I want ground. Why, like, Arlo? Because we killed Arlo earlier. At least these clouds are a little bit bigger. There's like a room to tech roll. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> okay, okay. I don't like that, that there's just like one balloon and it's so far away. Hmm. Yeah? Yes! Wow! Oh, it's like a snow globe! And there's a checkpoint! A trophy for meeting the horizon at the end of the Sky Needle in Yippie City. Well. 
Well, oh my, look at this bullshit. It's not over yet. Oh God, why? What the John Gamer Fries is going on here? Oh, I see. The sooner you cancel, the closer you are to the wall. I like it. Whoa. Okay. This is a little bit... Hey, what's that over there? I was going to say this is a little bit safer now, but I, I'm worried that I'm going to have to, like, jump out to that. Like, that's going to be, like, another thing for me to reach. Once I get to the top of the top of the Sky Needle. Oh. What's next here? Oh, well, that's not so bad. <gasps> it's the Sky Needle. Nice threading. But there was like green out there, wasn't there? Make sure to take the elevator down. But what is that over there? There's like green. I don't think I can, if it, oh, there's green over here. Can I make this jump? Oh. Tyler, please give me an answer because I'm about to reclimb this whole fucking thing over again. Like, it looks like a weird ass worm. But it's also like a ghost. Like, that. I don't think that's skybox fog. I think it's just actually transparent for whatever reason. I'm not sure I understand. Green is an Easter egg you should probably worry about. What do you mean, worry about later? That means that I'd have to play the whole fucking Sky Needle over again. No, I can't reach that. I don't have the distance to cover that whatsoever. I'll come back to it later. What the fuck ever. So it's an Easter egg? It, it, it doesn't even, does it count as a thing? Use. Oh, you can take the elevator back to the top now? Cool. Well, I'll be. Looks like we got a new Grand Tower Climber over here. Speaking of which, did you see Orson in there? A few minutes ago, we ran inside after you and... Oh my god! I guess the Sky Needle was too much for him. Bark, bark! So true, my car. Whoa, Dolce. Too soon. Easter egg involves zero things. That's good to know. He's a dead. As much as it pleases me to see Orson get his comeuppance, I'm a little bummed. The fine folks of Yippie City chose me as mayor because I was the only guy who stood up to tightwads like him. I always hoped that I could talk some sense into him, but sometimes they're too thick. What, the, what was the last line of dialogue? Because no Fire Emblem go back mode! My grandpa Old Man Majig was the mayor a while ago. He made it sound so boring. Non-stop paperwork? Turns out he was just doing the crossword puzzles most of the time. I'll just be here for a while. People might show up to ask what that definitely loud explosion noise was. Talking to Blockling, aren't ya? Consider this little dialogue of ours exhausted. Yeah, okay. Does that mean I can reread this? I didn't always want to be mayor. That was the line. Okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, I thought the music just, like, stopped for good. My bones! My expensive, expensive bones! I was so close this time. Almost as close as I was two months ago. If I die here, remember me as I once lived. Rich, handsome, and skilled. Surely this must be hell, with you having beaten me. No, this must be someplace far worse. I think I broke a nail in both my legs. Please don't stare at me like this. I'm miserable. If only someone would give a poor soul like me a sky needle orb to ease my troubles. I could pay you, you know. No one would ever know. Oh, I can see it now, the light. No, that's just the sun. I never even got remarried. Perhaps it's not too late. Is Mr. Mayor still present? Do you think someone in my state is still lovable? Never mind, you wouldn't know anything about inner beauty. 
maybe it's not too late to try again. Please, no more. The pain, it's too much for my feeble body. Why must God give his hardest battleist to his richest, most beautiful? Do you mean battles? Battles too? Okay, that, that loops over again too, I assume. Left clicking also advances dialogue. I like using the movement controls to, to talk to people. I was trying to use E, but E doesn't do shit, so spacebar is like a, a necessary evil in my book. Left clicking to advance dialogue. What is this? Log block adventure? So according to the, the things list, where does this leave me now? Locations? Yippee city. <gasps> the numbers! There's five more things, and one of them is already almost done if I can find that last vending machine. Okay, I did this. I fucked the hot dog. I killed the ketchup kids. Well, the house is here. Oh, maybe it's like under the road. There's like more going on to this like parkish zone. Hey, where do the doggy cars go at the end of the day. <laughs> the barking lot! <laughs> the, uh, the barking lot! <laughs> Alright, dude. Now we're talking. So... 1414? <laughs> God fucking damn it! How long is this? All right, and then what was the other one? Zero, 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 one. Ooh, very elegant jump from one to dial. Hello, hello. Yes, this is John Phone, creator of the telephone. I like the guy with the first IP address. Hi, John Phone. I assume you're calling because you're a big fan. Well, let me tell you, I get a lot of calls from people who hate my invention. So it sure does warm my heart to hear from a true phone lover like you. That's great, John Phone. Wow. Moments like these almost make up for all the bricks people have been throwing at my house lately. I have to go, John Phone. Thanks for the call. Bye. La, 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 la. Griffin does love his iPhone. That is true. Have we done this yet? I don't feel like- wait a second, hold on. It's- what are you doing up here? Oh, who is this guy? What the- look at this painting! Did someone like actually illustrate this or is this just a filter? It's Marmy Mill World. I want to take the treasure first. Oh, it's locked. <gasps> Did you just jump in my house? You. <laughs> and stay out! If you want to apologize, make it back up here without jumping! Without jumping? Oh my god. Oh! 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 Mm. 
that's a new one. Uh, an easy one, more like. Ahem. You'll have to excuse me. I have some reservations about jumping. Especially in my... Well, I guess it's... A, especially in my house. Guess I'll just let my guard down and expect the best of you from now on. Ah, salutations, my fellow biped. My name is Oompa. I come from a long line of folks who are very against jumping, in all its forms. Now, be honest with me. Did you jump to get here? No. So you claim to be jumpless, do you? Let's just see about that. <laughs> I wonder how many more times that sound effect is going to show up in this game. I appreciate it every time. Hmm. Ah, could it be? My friend, you didn't jump at all. I'm so full of joy to finally meet someone with your skill. Here, this is my most prized thing. I want you to have it. I locked it away long ago, fearful of its true power. But I'm sure someone like you can handle it just fine. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> wow. Take good care of it, would you? But promise to never use it. Did you just jump in my- oh my god! <laughs> That's really, really funny. What a dirty trick! Oompa. I do need to see now if I can jump through that painting though. I had a suspicion and now I definitely think I can. But then where would it go? Just back to Mommy Mo world? Oh, e okay, okay, okay! You know what, maybe I will, and maybe I'll keep my A button and you won't have any friends to treasure. Is that what you want? Whatever. Everybody wants me to go to the woods. I'll check out the woods. I did see, yeah, I did see, like, What's at Woods got, like, really, like, reorganized, but I don't know if that necessarily translates to, like, new stuff, or if it's just, like, more welcoming to newcomers. These pairs look new. One out of four. Man, I'm really impressed by um, the sprite work in this game, though. Like, that one character alone had a lot of different uh, poses and, like, cycles going on. Cool stuff. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, okay. Wait, are you new? What is this? Aww. Oh no, it is It is old. I think it was a worm or something. Or a bug. A larva, even. Uh, oh man, another house that's taped off? So many little tempting yummies. I do like what you're doing with the, um, the very, very light, like, particle fog. That's cool. Now, what the hell is this? Rock, paper, scissors? Very stylishly proportioned hands. What the? Rock. Scissors, paper, rock. Okay. Oh, it's one of these. Well, okay, that's the code. Now what? It's scissors, paper, rock, right? Okay, now what? It says versus though. I think versus is like something that I'm not like factoring in somehow. Is there a button to like lock in your answer or something? Versus. I don't understand what the versus part of it means. Griffin. Griffin what? Scissors, paper, rock. Do I just have to make it say rock, paper, scissors? I thought that's what it started as. Yeah, that doesn't do anything either. So scissors, paper, rock. 
Griffin solving a children's game. I made a match! I understand the idea that there, there's like a piece of information that I'm missing that maybe I'm like combining these inputs to get a new answer and that's what I input into this. Play rock, paper, scissors. Well, scissors beats paper and paper beats rock. And rock beats. So I get... So wait, what? I guess, what, all scissors? Oops, all scissors? Okay, so well, scissors beats paper, so scissors wins that. And then paper beats rock, so then paper wins, and then paper, so then, so scissors, paper, rock. Griffin, you're drawing a different conclusion than intended. So rock, rock, rock? There's no draw option if it's like supposed to be a tie. Like, is it asking me who the winner of these is and then I put in the winners? Are you okay? I'm trying to figure- I thought it was simple, okay? I made it match. Scissors, paper, rock, and that doesn't work. So now I'm trying to come up with, like, different shit. And I- is it, like, my first guess? No, but it, it's like- I'm coming up with different inputs. Rock does not beat all three. Well, rock- so- oh, so then it would be... Rock, scissors, paper? See, I think to me... I don't get the, in like, okay, so this goes to this, and this goes to this. It does not immediately to me read that this goes to this. So rock, scissors, paper. Whatever, I guess I'm the only stupid person in the world, and everyone else is so smart. That's funny. Hamster of peace. Is there like more forest here though? I don't recognize this either and this is like still the beginning. I want to find all the pairs before doing this next bit. Whoa. I do vaguely remember that Socks was erm. Um, developer was working on like a like a different kind of like seasonal foresty area. I'm very curious to see how that panned out. Skip Shroom Swamp. Oh, this is a new sub area. Ooh. Oh, I love how this. Look at this rock. Is that normal mapped? Oh, that looks great. Hey, cute stuff. Don't be so fast. Oh god. Hello? Oh. <gasps> no! Oh, I thought these were like cracks in the floor. They're just checkpoints. Well, that's nice. Ramblin' Mushroom. Really? Just like literally? That literally the thing. I mean, if you want. Okay, then that takes you back to the start. But what about the rest? And there's a fork in the road. I used to feel so comforted by the idea that there would only ever be two things per sub area, but now I think that rule is just broken. And I fear for my life. Like, even the areas where I'm like, where it was Arlo, I'm like, okay, this is gonna be like a unique new kind of room where it's you find one thing instead of two things and I'm like all right well that's cool but then you find two things in that place anyways ashcraft did the rock material it is hot stuff You were putting up what would beat those three in the same order. I was trying to match the password. 
Yeah, whatever. The king gets a new computer. What's the password? Hmm. Dinner? Spaghetti? No! I know how- I know how rock, paper, scissors works! There's more? Wait, I can roll. Let me roll under this, won't you please? Oh, what a cruel, cruel, twisted, fucked up world we live in. Yeah, now you do? No, I always did. I really and truly and I always did. I just want to get back to where I came from and I can't even do that. Yeah, I don't know. I like the idea of those challenges where in it's like when it's in an area you're familiar with, when it's like a like a brand new thing and you can also like just fall and fuck up the whole run and then you like walk back to the start. I don't know. It was cute in the city when it's like all ground beneath you and it's easy to recover from your mistakes. It's like, oh, here's this wall that serves no purpose but to make sure that if you miss up your route and you can't go back. Like, this is a mean one for an early area like that. Like, I don't, I don't even know where I came from right now. I can't hydrate, I'm drinking poison right now. Did anyone else know somebody back when Big Bang Theory was a thing that tried to get people to play rock, paper, scissors, laser, and Spock with them? Um, no. That sounds like hell, though. Is it just rock, paper, scissors, but instead of a weapon triangle, it's, it's a weapon pentagon? I don't know. Here, here's my advice with these things. Take it or leave it. I've got a similar function to this in LB8. Man, fuck! And then what do I do from here? Um, we're like, the, the next batch, where it's like, yeah, it's like a timed sequence of groups of things, but there's like a preview of where the next one is going to be, so you know that once you finish the current group, you know which one you're gonna go to next. And so when you're going through it on a first run, it's not a surprise when like you, you don't know where you're going and then the next one shows up and you're like, you're not set up for it and then you just fall in a bad way.
And the timing is really tight, too. Like, it's not my first problem, but I am, like, surprised by it. Oh, did it work that time? Okay, well, I guess that one counted. Alright, bring it home, Jerry! Oh, Christ! It's finally over! Aww! Oh, but the cute thing is so worth it! It's supposed to be obvious, but some of these are way too close to where the previous waves end. I will whack it with a polished stick. Snake a snake a snake oh it's a snake! So what about the rest of this though? I guess the idea is that because you need- what the fuck is this? Just literally like this? There's 12 of them?! They are in a place of mushrooms. But uh, yeah, it's in What's It Woods, but it does like require you to bring late game abilities to. Oh god damn it! There's a bit an LBA that's like this, and everyone's gonna think I stole it from Find Everything. Oh no! Please not again! Because <laughs> if I were like like a first time player coming here, I probably just would get like immediately checked by only having like this single jump and no dash or roll. Phew. That one's not so bad. Just for one of these fucks? I'm gonna poison this piece of shit. I hate you. Oh god, I don't like seeing more than one of them on screen at a time. It's very upsetting to me. Oh no, why are there so many of these? Why are there so many pictures of Kevin James on my photos app? Why is the Kevin James app on my phone? This one's a little interesting though. Oh! That's how many times the song says Badger. I think what you're not considering, which makes it cool for me to say it, is it'd actually be really easy for me to do, if you think about it that way. So let's take a step back and consider our options here, won't we? I don't like starting this sequence with only the one hit though, and I got pretty far the first time, but, but I mean, come on. Here's a faster way to do it. This way is better. I, can, I guess I di also like don't need to necessarily go against the grain is the other thing that would help a lot. Where? Where? Okay. Safety is where. They're surrounding me! Air Dash is your friend? It could potentially be, but I think I would like overshoot if I tried it. But I, it's, it's over, so don't even worry about it. I do like how open this area feels though. Whenever you're doing, like, one given jump, it always feels like there's two more places for you to, like, branch out to. It'd be cool if there was something on top of the log, but I don't know if you can, like, get on top of it from down there. Okay. There's eight. I think this is the highest point. No, it's not. This is. Uh, I did that one. Wait a second. Have I been this way? What in the... 
Oh god. Oh! The true speedrunner tech just has it go as fast as the song. What's a... Hey, you guys know about that like that like secret subscription video? That that secret YouTube tier that lets you watch videos even slower than 0.25x speed? I can do the that version of that challenge. Griffin, watch out, don't get hit. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in the back pocket. I value the input. Help? I don't know what happened there. There you are. This is the guy who tried to attack my little family of foxes in Endling. I hold no respect for the badger. You really are Griffin Gaming right now. It's just actually hard, that's all. The normal map for the wood is also really nice. I don't know, man, there's shit on timers and other cycles line up and sometimes I grab the ledge of the thing and I just fall down into doing the wall kick. One. I should have just gone deeper into the woods instead of ever finding this door. All of this for one thing! go out and around? Okay. I thought there was like maybe a little second door I could use, but... Okay, ten! Where to from here? This wall isn't really usable, is it? No! Not even a little bit. What the? Or is it? Or is it? Wait, what? This works? Now that's Griffin Gaming! Uh oh. But I think there's like an earlier one in the sequence that I didn't get, which could be difficult. There it is, I see it! Oh, it's over. Guess I got my badger back. Alright, I think that's everything. I think it's time to officially leave. Once and for all and forever. Hi, the snake. The snake is okay. Oh, Christ! Why was that like the harder than the sky needle for me? All right, let me see this cool place. Whoa, Ballyhoo Bluffs. <laughs> hey, did you know you can roll down hills to build up a ton of speed? I've been doing it all day. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, there's slopes. Aw, oh, man, the tree is locked off? It didn't have to be like this. Whoa! Oh, there's caves. And pits. I found the depths, guys. They pick up? What? Huh? I don't know what I'm holding right now. Does someone need this? Anybody? Anywhere? Is that a seed? I'll put this down for a little bit and hopefully it doesn't despawn. Oh, brother. This area is cute, though. Hmm? 
He's gonna stay out. Oh. Oh, you don't even need to throw. We're good. Alright, so pots are always nearby, right? Right? Oh god, I'm gonna freak out. I, I don't see it. There's a leaf! I'll get the leaf! Neat leaves, one of six. Wait a second! This is not... a seed. This is just like a fucking rock. Do you want it? Rolling around all day is so fun. My head is pounding and, he's, and I see zigzags when I close my eyes. <laughs> hey, do you have a phone? Can I look up what a concussion is? By the way, watch out for giant chestnuts. One hit me on the head the other day and I couldn't see colors for a couple of hours! One time I hit my head so hard I saw a flash of light. Do you guys know what that means? Oh god, I think they do despawn. Fuck! I don't know where to bring these two. That's gonna be a problem. I guess I'll wait to be quested upon before I do anything with that stuff. Oh, cool shape of a platform. This is a cool idea for a find everything area though. It's it's vertical, which you know we've seen before in things like Yippie City, but it's also like very like it's it's much denser. It's not as wide, but it's just as tall. And it's layered too. See, this one's a seed. So where does this one go to? Up there? Oh, I I've got to make, make some sort of crazy bridge here. Okay. I think these are all the- I thought I would have to like make like a much bigger sequence, but this will get the job done. Oh, uh, why are there so many of these? Wow! Oh, that's why. They're all just like a sub thing. Oh, that meant the light in your brain turned on for a second. Oh, that's always supposed to be on? Whoops. There's something I really like that you've gone to the trouble of making these little out-of-bounds areas for, like, the edges of the worlds. I guess in LBA a lot of the time I just kind of do walls. But I suppose there is value in, like, oh yeah, here's just, like, a, like a big bottomless pit, but it's, like, kind of pretty about it. There's, like, spikes and there's water and stuff. It's cool. Oh, wait, you can just, like, keep grabbing more of these? Alright. I thought each of these was gonna have, like, a multiple seeds in different locations. Yeah, it just keep, it keeps coming back. So eventually, the sequence is going to expand to encompass all of this. Here's an idea. Oh, but of course you can't roll while holding these either. That counts as a shift thing. I don't know, yeah, this is cute. I like this edge area. What the hell is that? It's Leonard. It's a whole big world out there, huh? I think I'd rather observe it from here. Very, very far away. You know, I hear there are lots of things you can find, if you look closely. Waterfalls with secret rooms, walls that break apart when you smack them. Well, um, my secret? I've never talked to a girl before. Once, I found a secret thing nestled away in a wall, but I kept it there for someone else to find. If you can get to it, you can keep it. How does that sound? 
Seriously, just to throw yourself at any suspicious walls. Either the wall will break, or you will. Movie toy. Virtual reality at its finest. Whoa! Out of bounds place isn't just for show. What what the, what in the Trolls World Tour is this? Trendy Gremlin. Oh. Another working possum. Yeah, I don't know who did the music for this area. I think I'd have to leave and come back, and then it would show the, the artist credit again. All I know is that we have seen two of the three things that Max did for this update. There's the Mare Majig music, which we saw. There's, oh, there's the USB. We gotta get that. Um, there's the phone house, and there's one more thing. Hello? Okay. Weelable did this one. Okay. Huh? Oh. They're hinged. Yes. I like the cute, unique designs for every single one of these. It's got, like, leaves on it. Petals, even. Um, how much more can you climb this? To the point where it's, like, allowed of you to do. No, this is definitely out of bounds. But, or is it, though? Oh, no, this is- it doesn't let you go any further than this. Oh, well. Uh, what else? I guess I have one more leaf, I think. Whoa! This is new! Okay. Man, I love the layout of this area. It's fun to just poke around these little, like, nestled away corners. Or as, uh, as that one guy up there would say, nestled. Oh, man, I like this a lot. Oh, and then it connects to Bluehoo, which I guess might also have some new stuff, come to think of it. What are you? Handsome baby flower alert. Tulip cools baby. What's up, buddy guy? I'm out here photosynthesizing. If I don't grow a baby tulip chest here before springtime, I'm nothing. Uh-huh. Under these jammies, I got cool baby muscles. Doctors say it's an abnormality, but cool babies got images to upkeep. Yeah? The day I was born is the day God created a beautiful baby boy. I don't have a mama or a dada. I'm just a cool baby freak of nature. Sure. Hey, it's not easy being a gorgeous guy everybody loves. Handsome boys cry too. And handsome boys like me get apple juice and baby bottles until I feel better. Okay. Next time you're feeling low, drink apple juice. Out of a baby bottle. Take my advice and you'll be as cool and lovable as me. Yeah? I'm a cool baby flower with a lot of love in my baby heart. I love toys and juice. But more than anything, I love to be handsome and beautiful. Okay. Since you love talking to me, let me give you a hint about a cool baby secret. Just talk to me a little more to learn my cool baby secret. Most important thing to my coolness? Being me. Second most important thing, exfoliating. Flowers aren't supposed to exfoliate, but cool people do. It's a conflict of interest, but my interest is mostly in being a cool baby. Secret, please. I'm the most handsomest guy in town, but being cool is only one thing. I'm also the most humble guy in town, and I'm a kind person, too. Being a cool baby is nothing without a little self-reflection. Otherwise, you'll never see how handsome you are. Secret, please. You must really want to be a cool baby like me, huh? Well, sorry, you're too old to be a cool baby, but you can be a friend of a cool baby. Thanks for talking to me. No one ever hangs out with me for that long. I may be a cool baby, but you're the coolest of all. So I'll share with you my cool baby secret. Ready for it? Here it comes. The secret passcode for the juice bar is juice. <laughs> okay, I will go now. <laughs> the fucking elements of Roblox are your catchphrase. Yes! Did Socks write this? It, it feels Soxy to me. I think it's Soxy dialogue. That's my opinion. <laughs> Seek up trees to know for the distinctive leaves, especially during the fall. Yeah, so the juice bar, I know the juice bar is like the third thing that Max wrote for. 
But is it here? I thought it might be in like Yippie City. <gasps> I understand. Say no more. Yes, Master. There was something about man. I don't want to say it, but the Mega Sixty Four show I watched. There was a there was there was a bit about Gruntilda, and it is really funny. <laughs> And I saw the cauldron and I thought of it, but I want to say it! I can't talk about it! It's my duty as an internet soldier. Where did I even find half of this hidden shit? I think I just like kept like climbing up and I found it like on a high up ledge or something. I assume that these like pick upable things go back to where you found them after long enough. After long enough. <laughs> Neglected. Left lost and alone. Socks wrote the dialogue, I wrote the responses, hence the elements of Robloxia joke. It's all against the same wall, they're all against the same wall. Okay, got it. I'm just kind of collecting stars right now because it's fun. When the hell are Socks going to play elements of Robloxia already? They were onto something with the Roblox Adventure streams and you had the, like, the, the, the Lala dog head and the Alvins. But then that was it, and then, then now there's nothing else. Oh, there's the juice bar. I'll do that after my spells. I think it's down. I think it's more down. Like, at least I can find this. I have no idea where the hell that other ingredient was. It was like the first thing I set my eyes on, and my hands, in this world, and now I'm nothing. Wow! Great effect. I wonder what we're cooking. I don't know, man. Like, a potato chip and a brick? And macaroni? I think it's like all the way at the bottom. Wait, what are you? Flying goblin? Oh, yeah. It's down here. Okay. And now I just take it up, without rolling. Like a good little ingredient finder, like a good little grocery shopper. Oh, I guess we're like all in different caves against the same wall, it's perhaps the bit here. Are you making some sort of witch's boo? Oh, a little higher up now. I wonder if we find the third ingredient, then something even more amazing will happen. Hmm. Maybe it, like, literally is near the juice bar. I keep thinking that this is where, like, got into the woods. I think I'm wrong. Here we go, yeah. What the hell is going on here? Uh-oh. <gasps> Phew. I guess, yeah, macaroni. I guess that was like a nugget that I made, maybe? And then a brownie. Mommy made it. This is like all gluten. If this is some sort of like Western cultural touchstone that everybody is supposed to know of, it's, it's news to me. Yeah, literally not a single one of those things I'm familiar with. I'm gonna wait for this creature to come uh, around another circle of the tree, and I'll grab it. You. You're mine. Yes! Whimsical creature! It's you when you were a baby! Do you remember? 
Did you never have a swag meal? No, I did not. And I didn't even have any of its constituent ingredients either. My swag meal is broccoli meaty, and that's the way I like it. Passcode, please. Um, lots of spaghetti? Incorrect. Please return when you know the passcode. Um, open salami. Incorrect. Please return when you know the passcode. You never had a nugget or macaroni before. No, they have gluten in them, dumbass. Correct. Please enjoy your stay at the juice bar. Please enjoy your stay at Hot Tune House. Fun bill, baby. Let's fucking go. Oh my god. Look at all these characters. Big Chug? Mr. Chug Body. I'm, I'm drawn to this character the most. How fancy and delightful this establishment is for someone like myself. The eyes? I hear that there's a performance going on any minute now. Dinner and a show. This is fantastic. There's nothing I love more than Emma's juice and appetizers. I think I'll just take a drink right now. Oh! <laughs> you know, this place really reminds me of the time I... This comment is awaiting analysis by our automated content check system. It will be temporarily hidden until we verify that it does not contain harmful content, e.g. links to website that attempt to steal information. You are quite friendly. Has anyone ever told you that? Maybe too friendly. Please don't talk to me anymore. Ah, ah, mm, uh, okay, okay, okay. I love juice. I love juice! Hi, do you want some of my juice? Just kidding, I drank it all. <laughs> Yay! My dad doesn't let me have sugar anymore. He says it makes you crazy. The people who obey the rules and the laws are considered normal by society. Isn't that ironic? I don't know. Actually, kind of all the characters are awesome so far. I used the last of my grandma's inheritance money to buy this drink. At least I have this juice to cheer me up today. My juice? No, you can't have any. It's my favorite drink in the whole world. If you want some, you can ask the waitress. The Quackles hat? It's so loud out here. I usually hide in the bathroom, but someone's been in there all night. Maybe I'm not cut out for socialization. I should probably just go home, right? I wish I didn't get so nervous in public. I'm in no shape to be out here like this. I think I'll leave soon. Thanks for talking to me. If the bathroom opens soon, can you let me know? I just need to get in there and breathe. Okay. Who else we got? I don't know what this thing is. Rapunzel. Can I get a juice? Oh my god! What is this, like, Dora's camera? <laughs> ants? Canned ants. I bet they won't have- wow, they have it. Canned ants. Is there anything else I can get from the sh- I really want the Bloxy Cola. Gamer Fries Cola! Gamer Juice. Paintings? Smiling. What is this, even? Aw, it's Gamer Fries and, and Nobly! That's beautiful! <gasps> apple Blood! Fresh from the Apple Butcher. Whoa. The lighting in here? Sorry, do you need to get in here? I'm gonna be a while. I'm really nervous to come out. That's okay. Thanks for being patient with me. Sorry, okay, well, what's wrong? I'm scared that no one out there will like me. What if everyone laughs at me or thinks I'm stupid? Yeah, you're a freak. You're right. How could anybody ever love someone like me? <laughs> you're not stupid. You really think so? That's the nicest thing anyone has ever said to me. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna show the world who I really am. Here I come. It's the guy who played Super Bomb Survival! Vexatious Orange. And yet he rose from the dead, the beast now free once more. Close the door, close the door, close the door! <laughs> I already got this, the apple blood. I need some orange blood right now, dude. That is a lot of juice, my word. Yeah, get it back in there. Aw, hello. Is there anything else backstage? 
I guess just this. Oh, uh, hello. My name is Epic Monkey. At least, that's my show name. I'm supposed to do a big performance here tonight, but I, uh... I have really bad stage fright. I just need someone to convince me I'm not gonna choke. Can you help me overcome my fear of the limelight? It'd be really helpful if someone or something could inspire me. Whoa! Oh, God. Let's give him the Vexatious Orange. Huh? You wanna show me Vexatious Orange? Oh my god, it's so bright out here! Wait, you're going to go on stage? Are you crazy? Someone like you could never perform in front of so many people! You should give up while you're young! You can be just like me, unemployed at 37! That was the last thing I needed to hear right now. And <laughs> the music! Maybe we should try something else. Okay. Uh, how about Apple Blood? Everybody could use a little bit of juice. You brought me a snack? I mean, the thought is nice, but I'm not gonna eat something off the floor. I may be an animal, but I have standards. Hmm. Let's give me the, the apartment bear. Hmm. I mean, it's a cool thing and all. Not really feeling the inspiration here, though. Sorry. Interesting then that the um that the annoying orange has like a unique interaction. What could be inspiring? We gotta do the cringe blue jay. So, got any inspiring words? Um, okay, dude. What if there's girls out there? You want to impress them, don't you? If they like your performance, can you tell them I helped you with it? Thanks. But I don't even like girls. Yes! So that one was not from this area, but it still had like special dialogue. I want to do Crying Noob Covered in Bugs. There's a fair amount of unique dialogue. Wow. It kind of makes me fear for my life, actually. Please put it back. <laughs> wow. Yeah, for 220 things, you gotta, like, have some sort of answer for whatever the player tries. Hmm. Let's give the monkey a virus. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Do we have anything from, like, the dump? I want to do dump stuff. Yeah, how about uh, the heart? You want to show me the heart? Ew, what is that? Looking at it makes you want to throw up. And I only wanted to throw up. Wait, I've got it. I've got it. And I don't even like girls. Locations. Yummy yum yard. Rainbow jelly. Huh. Are you saying that I should just go out there and be proud of who I am? Gee, that's so sweet! Tell you what, I'm gonna give it my all out there! Wait, that actually works?! No more hiding behind the curtains! Yeah, you got it, Epic Monkey! It's all you! Knock him dead! That's right. That's right, we stand a gay icon. Thanks so much for everything. The crowd loved me. Huh? You have a look on your face. Oh, how rude of me. I guess I do owe you for being such a big help. Here, take this. From one superstar to another. Aww. An autograph. I know it's not much, but... I don't have pockets. And hey, it might be worth a lot someday. It's stained with the juice. The messy mark of a true artist. That was sweet. <gasps> sweet like of juice. Wow, awesome fucking location. I 
I can't wait to hear what else you get Max to score for Find Everything. All of the stuff that you've managed to squeeze out of them, one might say, uh, has really been some of the best stuff in the game so far. And I'm really not just saying that. Like, I'm sad that I have to leave the juice bar, because I was, like, really enjoying myself in there. Alright, so what, what are the numbers here? There are 40 things left. 39, even. Which is, um, you know, you know, which, you know is 82%. Okay, yeah, there's, there's a couple of, like, unfinished things that I've done. Uh, I gotta do the rest of the Dancing Flowers, which is pretty easy. The Chalk Hearts, obviously. Um, I think this and the Pears is quick. Scriga's Cola, I still don't know where the fourth one is, so I don't need to go back to that immediately until I have any ideas. Um, but I think there's more I can do here. Hey, let's find some sub areas. I bet this place has like a sub area besides just like the juice bar, like a cool little obby area, but one that isn't like the place that I had trouble with in What's It Woods. Yeah, I can see a little bridge up here. If I go to the bridge, then that'll be something. Hello? Oh, here. Oh, this is gonna demand that I master my rolling, isn't it? Oh. Okay, so it does. Con See, this is what I would like if, like, the next stage was like somewhat telegraphed. Because then you can, like, confidently know, like, where you're going to book it to. They are named Max because of their maximum talent. So fucking true! Oh man, this is gonna be like a whole tour through the entire thing, isn't it? I like this strange little corner with like classic blocks in it though. I don't know what its deal is, but it is like an intriguing mystery. Oh man, you've really gotta zoom through this entire place, don't you? That might have been too much time. Shit! I think that was the last step, too. So it's, it's one loop around this, like, rim. ones here are the where I like messed up. Oh. Oh. That last one is really rough and it really bothered me. This one is like, I'm not cranky about it like I am with the green stars in that sub area. Because this is graspable, it's just not very generous with the timing. Which is like, which is like it's allowed to be. do that. Oh no, this one's not happening. Yeah, well, what's like a good strategy for the ones in the air? I don't really have any good ideas for that. 
I like the idea of like keeping the speed I get from the crazy rolling from the, the section of stars that comes before. But as soon as I start jumping, I, I always throw it. Hello? Falling? Oh, jeez. Am I getting so laser focused on this? I need complete silence for this spell. This first half I'm pretty reliable at. Shit! And these last two are rougher. But if I can do the Sky Needle, I think I can do anything. Ultimately, that's the takeaway. Put me in there, coach. Oh, no, no, no. Help! Oh, it's not over. like a lot of time to get these last ones too. Yes! Wow! Hi! Dapper Bear, just goofing off, lol. Okay, I will go now. Alright, so that frees me up at long last. To go back around to these flower pots, because this is easy to finish off. So that needs to be... I need to get these all out. So they do retract if you, like, go far enough away, I guess. There we go. Hello, the we're back department. I'd like to file a claim. I don't know when I got distracted from this, but it's time for that to uh, to stop. I don't know if it is like Jebel. I want to. I don't think that Jebel, if ever, like took me that long to beat. Um, it was it was when I streamed Undertale the the Undyne and Sands runs when I did the genocide route. That those were like the the, the craziest. Um, that I that I got stuck on something like they they really do go toe to toe with Hollow Knight, and as a matter of fact, I think the Undyne one like took me longer than Sans like literally. What? Oh, I guess I already did this one maybe. Well, how about this one? Yeah. All right. So that's three out of four. Did I not do the one up here then? That seems like an obvious miss. Uh, where did the seed go? Oh, down here. Oh, I'd love a dick! These guys wouldn't say that. I would. Oh, no. Don't retract. Don't be shy. That's better. No, don't leave me! Oh, maybe that's what happened last time is that I just overshot it. Come 
sign it. I saw the little like arc that rolled off of it. It totally touched. Arc, 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 arc. I should probably follow those nuts to the source too. Oh, I just already got this one. Did I not get this one? This is the one that's missing? I... That's it. I did all, all of these then. Because the one on that cliffside wasn't, like, reacting. I think you planted it but forgot to grab it and now it's bugged. Oops. Oh, okay. But in my thing decks, it's listed as, like, three out of four. So... So what should I do about it? If I come back, will it be fixed? Or do I just, like, need to wait for a patch? What is this? Oh, okay. Just a normal thing. Is this a new part of Bluehoo Beach? Or is this just, like, related to the... The Donkey Kong Barrel world? Oh, no, it is new. It looks like this area is really going to put my knowledge of these arcs to the test. So this seems like a jump and a throw to me. Rejoining should work? Okay. I like this. Being able to, like, throw and then having your midair stuff, like, back right afterwards. I guess I could double jump and then throw but I kind of like how I do it better here. Like this. Yeah! That's how it's done. Who's it gonna be? Whoa! I don't know, guys. I was saying pretty cool things about the dinosaur. This is a pretty cool guy. Garden eel. Whoa! Invisible stars. But how will I find them if I can't rub my Wii U gamepad? Oh, is the code on the beach still a thing? No, that's a working possum. Damn. I was really looking forward to cracking the code, finding out the secrets. Oh, this area's been changed. I like it though, it's like kind of a little, a little dried out, specific little spot. Um, what the scallop? Is the house over here a thing you can go inside? No, game dev line do not cross. I mean, I may as well rejoin now. At least doing it from, like, within the Roblox app shouldn't be, like, so bad. Because then I don't have to, like, fiddle with screen share stuff. I'm just, like, still technically, like, in it. Uh, I might be in, like, a different server now, though. No, I think I recognize some of these user usernames. I think I'm still fine. Okay, what do we have here? So... Hide found... Dancing flowers. I still have three out of four. So which is the one that I didn't get? I guess I can do the pair as well in passing by. Here's another one of you. And here's the last one. That wasn't so hard, was it? Shoutouts to all the pair. It's cool to see, now that this area is, like, properly connected, the little teases that you can get. I'm imagining the experience of a player playing this, playing Find Everything for the first time in 2.0 instead of 1.0, or 0.2.0, if you will. And thinking about, like, the, the sorts of surprises that they'll see, like, just cresting over. These little ledges that they, that they can just barely not get through. It's cool. Alright, so, who is missing? Which one of you do I need to speak to?
It's the leftmost one, I think, up here. Let's give it a shot. Yep, that's the one. All right. It does this when distressed. What's going on here? Ew! What is this? I can't talk to it. Can I push it? Can I push it off and then like shatter it? I don't know what's happening here. This thing is not getting pushed. Hmm. Is there a giant gun pointing at it, perhaps? That would be a start. I suspect not. Hey, but here's an idea, though. I keep putting off that mysterious door every time I pass by it. Enough is enough. I've done this enough times where I can't get away with it anymore. Hmm. So I need to roll this into this position, and then be up there. I like these, um... Fun little twists on the idea of the pile of leaves. Because in the forest area that precedes this... Whoa! Hi! Party worm! Looks more like a party pillar, if you ask me. Where the earlier area establishes, like, oh yeah, you can kick piles of leaves and you can get, like, little stars. That's, like, a fun thing that you want to do. But now you get springs out of it, which helps you, like, uh, tangibly progress. And, like, opens up new little routes. Satisfying stuff. Alright. Give me a new sub-area. What do we got? Ballyhoo Bluff's Prickle Thorn Canopy. Ooh. Oh, now it's like bouncy. Oh, I'm into this. This level design. What, what is it attached to? Like, it's like tilting and swaying. But this is staying upright? I'm into that. I'm really into that. Oh, so not only is it a trampoline, but if you touch the ridges, it like hurts you. Oh, this is a fun area. Whee! Oh, it's a grind rail! Oh, this rules. Whoa. Oh, fascinating! I really like how this is designed. This is one of my favorite little sub areas, I think. And you can use, if you're good enough, you might be able to use that like rolling down a hill tech on like the one side of the, the log to constantly be accelerating down the right half of it. Maybe I'll go on the inside though. Oh, it's solid. Okay, I won't do that then. I don't know, something like that. Smarter gamers than I may be able to take advantage of this as a viable strategy. Cool. Man, I really like this. Uh-oh. There's a lot of head still. I feel like I'm still in the, the stage of this where it's still like establishing its ideas. And it's yet to really like let them loose and take me for a ride. And we got a thing! Hello! Detestable crow. This crow is so spiteful. And for what? Wait a second, though. I already see another way to go. 
I'm not done here yet. Going through a door and only expecting one thing could never be me. Whoa. Okay, this is what we're doing now. Oh god. Oh, this is cool. God, find everything's grind rails are so cool. <laughs> More like grind everything. Back to the start of the sequence I go with that one. That might be a little, like, agonizing to retry repeatedly, but... I'm into what this is doing here. Where there are, are these rails going through these areas, but you're constantly, like, trading on and off of them. And trying to, like, get good time. Whoops! Griffin. Griffin the button. Oops. I don't know what like a good camera angle for this is. There's a lot of like whirling and twirling. We'll zoom out a little bit more. Have like a like a larger perspective of the area. I can see like a few more steps ahead at the very least. Man. Let me let me just test something here. That's not a good place to test it. Because the thing about grind rails is that you carry your speed when jumping off of them, so when going off of a curve, do you follow the curve or do you just go on a tangent? And you have to manually control yourself aerially to get back onto the rail, because that's what I've been doing and I'm fearing that my doing that input is responsible for, like, more deaths than I care to admit. Hold on, there's like an early rail if I go this way, right? Uh, not really. It's not really a great time to start experimenting with the nuances of it, because there's so many, like, spiky things that can, like, just make it difficult to even test to begin with. And also I'm, like, in the middle of trying to do something else, but I want to keep that in the back pocket. It feels like I am going on tangents, though. I'm just not adjusting as well as I wish I did. It's just like we a weird thing to have to fight. Not that it's like an unusual thing to find in a game that does have grind rails, but... I don't know. Maybe the solution is out there. I, th I don't think Splatoon was like this in Splatoon's grind rails. I think those ones, if you jump on a grind rail, you do follow the curvature of it. You don't have to like readjust to re-land on it. Shiny little bulbs on the end of these, though, are very, like, I don't know if appetizing is the right word to, but they're nice to look at. Like, especially up close, you can see the whole world in that material. Okay. Let's get out of here. Nice! Okay, these are freebies. This one's a double jump. Whoa, okay. We're doing this now? This is the furthest I've, I've made it. Whoa! 
shoot, that could have been a good recovery. It didn't have to be over like that. I wonder how close that was to the end. I don't think I- it doesn't feel like that's been in sight at the moment. Not through yet. doesn't feel great to lose all your momentum when double jumping either. I get that that's on purpose, but on grind rails when it's like a deliberate part of the challenge, it's hard to predict the movement, I guess? Yeah, because you carry it on a single jump and then double jump just kills it entirely. Oh! Dang, that was a new personal record. I don't even know what happened on that one. with depth perception these last couple of attempts. always the opportunity if I really wanted to, to to just try running these rails without the stars on them and then maybe I could like just spend some time getting better at the platforming before adding like the timed component to it which again is what I liked about the Yippie City one first and foremost is that you have the familiarity first and then the star challenge comes second but this is just like a brand new area oh this has got to be it that's the end easy Oh my god, the shoes? Why is it like posed like Among Us drip? Fresh avocado. <laughs> Didn't know he was chill like that. Alright, how's the thing decks looking? 188? 32 things left. 85%. very vividly remember the Among Drip room in Hollowed Hero. I hope there's an equivalent to it in Find Everything, and I'm not talking about the thing that I just found. I mean that I want more. Uh, okay. I did say that I was going to inspect the chestnuts for a little bit. I'm gonna look into that. Because they're like, they, they've gotta be coming from somewhere, right? What happens if it just like, keep going up? Oh, just, like, from tree branches, I guess? Yeah, I don't think that's, like, anything specific that I can, like, do. Uh, okay, secrets behind waterfalls. I don't know, I think I might actually have a pretty good grasp on this area. Let's, um... 
If I have a warp drive for it, and it's called Ballyhoo Bluffs, then that means it's its own category as a location. And hide found. Oh, that's right, I didn't find the bird. Boar vessel, siplet. I mean, maybe that's also in the juice bar. A siplet. That sounds pretty likely. Maybe something in the rafters. A siplet. Oh jeez, I mean, yeah, there's like some like slightly high up things, but... I never said dot dot dot, what is that? Oh, it just declines, okay. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything juicy around these parts. Nothing up here. Hmm. Come back. And that's the thing is that I think the first time I played Find Everything, I was able to get like Tyler tips for it. Okay, dangling leaf. That's a new thing. Easy. But I think it has reached that time of night where I am just kind of alone and I do have to figure out like kind of some of the more obtuse secrets. Which, uh, I don't know, man. This game is pulling shit like Elder Ring in 0 0.1. That could be an issue. Let's see, though. Let's, let's not even narrow it down to any particular area. Like, where else have I not been? Mount Duda's got new things. Yummy Yum Yard. Poppy Park. All, all the existing areas kind of had to have some other things. I never got the gold gym degree, apparently. That could be an easy one. Yeah, there's like a lot of Mount Duda. Tiger poster. Okay. Mount Duda feels like my best bet. I haven't visited that area at all tonight, and it looks like there's like the most new things there. Even more so than uh, Paw Bean Park. Please enjoy playing our game, enforced by Sniper. Dumb entrance is a little touched up too, I like it. Uh, okay. So this is crucially not Mount Duda. I wanted to go to the gym first. Which has also been kind of reoriented a little bit. So what, I just, I just go here and I get the degree? Air dash course. Yeah, I guess when I came here, I must have, like, gotten the things, but I didn't, like, get the degree from going through the, the hoops. Which is the easier part of this, so that's not so bad. Wait, unless I just didn't get these either. Wait, what? Plastic throwing discs? Why is that being treated as new? I have the air dash, did I not get these or something? Huh. All right, I'll grab them, I guess. Unless the idea is that you can like retrain by recollecting them. Hmm. The short or quirkier name for this is copyrighted. Show me my thing decks. Yeah, no, both of these are, are considered like new collectibles. Hold on, locations, Thingsburg. Did all of my tutorial stuff get overwritten? No, these are normal. Glow sticks? I had glow sticks! Some of my things are like missing. I guess if like the, the way to obtain it was like significantly changed between version one and two, then you have to recollect it. I mean, these are like minor things, but I, that's my best guess at, as to what is happening, because I definitely got the glow sticks. Right, like I go behind me and then there's like a, a single thing and then I... Yeah, they're just empty again, I wonder why.
Okay, I think I know where all of these are. And who knows? It could very well be that the, the secret in the buildings is like there's a thing for it now. Oh god. There we go. I don't want to leave that behind. It's the only thing I'm here for. Ah, oh, the checkpoint was right there. The health refill and all. And now. No! I meant not to go in this! Oh well. I don't think it has anything to do with the glow sticks, but... Hold on. What are the names of the items? None of these feel like some like 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 a party dog or anything, for example. I might be safe. You missed a glow stick? Are they talking to me or I don't think so. I think I know where the glow stick- There's like one at like the end of the sequence, isn't there? Yeah, then we're talking to, to this song guy. There's one coming up. Okay, yeah, three out of four. No sweat. I do vaguely remember there being like one like as soon as you land in this area, but I'm not seeing it through the window, so I think I'm alright. I don't remember any being down here either, that was my problem. There's like a weird ledge there though, like the yellow pla- is that a glow stick? It is! Maybe I got only ever three- because I don't recognize that platform worth a damn. I don't know why that's there. Unless of course, the weird spot that I'm remembering it having been in earlier. Like that's where it used to be and then it got moved and that's why my save is weird about it. It's my best guess. this a little bit better. Oh! I guess you have to jump out of it. Like this? No, you can't. You can't jump out of it. What's the strategy for that, I wonder? Are the little barrels not the way to get to it? There are balloons. I guess I have to hit the balloons and then dash off of that. There we go! Now let's get this party started. Oh, I understand how you work. Man. It's okay. I can play it normal and I'll be all right. I like the idea of that location. It's just like very awkward to get to. Like none of the springs are really helpful in getting you to or from it. All right, and I'm out. Assuming that there's no thing to find in a, in that place that I was trying to go to earlier. We don't need to think about who we just saw in that window. We can ignore that. Okay, what else is around here? Was this here always? No. Hold on. If there's like a basketball item that I can throw in there, 
I might be onto something here. Oh, I don't see anything. Right, I was gonna go. go to, I was gonna go to Mount Duda though. I think this is best for me. This is planted, right? These things don't stay, so I don't know for sure. But of course the yum fruit do. Yeah, I got this one. Whoa! Hello! Hello, you sticky lizard. I think I'm being cute for saying this, but- Oh! You're also new! As soon as I get this fifth one, the flavor text is gonna say exactly that. Oh! Breath of the Wild reference. Does this game have depth of field? I feel like there's depth of field the more I, like, see out. It also looks like there's a maximum render distance, which is weird because my maximum graphics quality is, like, it can't go any higher, but for some reason I can't see all the way out to the edge? Like, there's shit that's, like, disappearing. I guess the game has, like, its own custom LOD system? Aw, man! I'm a little bummed out by that. As the world grows, I would love to, like, gradually... ...see the horizon expand as the, as the game, like, gets more and more complete. It's a little bit of a shame that there's not really going to be an opportunity to appreciate that, I guess. Yeah, right, okay. So I did this waterfall. Ah, oh, but there's one of these here now. Oh, you fucker. Of course you put one of these here. Right at the base of the waterfall. Oh! Ew! You guys got the pogfish working? Look at the way it smiles so satisfied when it gobbles you. I'm sorry, not the pogfish. That's a different animal. I'm th this is the port knight. Of course. Oh! <laughs> oh, I gotta go around. Okay, give me, give me a good roll here. They come out fast, though, is the thing. They come out fast and hard. A goal. Man, what happened earlier where there was, like, like a huge, like, clog up? Go. There was a zone that was so full of logs and they were so slow and jammed up. That's the way it should have been always. Here, we'll do it this way. I could, like, try throwing the seed? I don't know. Hey, this is a good opening. Yes! Okay, smooth sailing. It's a smooth ride from here to the shore. Or, uh, where is it? Um... Phew! Hey, where's that pot again? Be careful not to miss this shot. Oh! Hairy onion. I feel a rhythm. Anyone got some tweezers? So that one's accounted for now. There's... That's still blocked off by the game dev line. I want to climb back up to the top of this, then I want to check my hints. Or uh, my thing decks to see if, like... I can intuit kind of where to go next. Oh! Okay, I guess I'll do that then. I'll do that first. Good thing I have the warp drives. Hi, Mr. Majig. Yeah, 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 let me in. Oh! 
What the? Connection attempt failed. What about my things? And my ev having every one of them. I was, my original plan was to play this after Mario Kart yesterday, but Roblox was like shitting like crazy. Like it was just like straight up down. That's not what's happening right now, is it? Uh, cause that would be, that would be a, a, a tragedy. Yeah, let me just like open a Safari tab and go to the Roblox website here and just make sure that, uh, I mean, yeah, the, the website looks fine. Uh, I sure am consistently failing to connect to it though. Uh, yeah, what if I try like playing it from the browser and then it'll just like, I assume. No, it actually sucks. I mean, it worked. I was hoping it would like take over the window that I already had open, but no, it just like moved to a different display and took away the one that I had. But we're back in business. So where was I? Mount Duda. Phew. Wasn't looking forward to having to stop there. So close to finding everything in one run. Oh, I guess the caves are a thing. Is there new cave stuff? Hold on. No, Do Not Caverns is like a different category. It's worth checking. Yeah, okay. There's, there's, there's nothing new here. We're, we're, we're in the clear. Uh, okay. So it's all outdoors. That's actually very relieving to me. Right. I remember this. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing anything from the upper levels that I, that I wouldn't have seen otherwise. There could be, like, new stuff behind a waterfall, maybe. I don't know. Maybe, like, walk on it. That's nice. And it hasn't really expanded much, either, is the thing. Oh, actually, no, yeah, there's caves up here. I think that's all new stuff. That's where the warp drive was. Yeah, hold on. Is there a way to get up to that? There is. There's a branch up here. Oh, so I got this. Is this new? Oh, button challenge. It all makes sense. Whoa, cool. Oh no, it's him! Balding Eagle, the mighty stream of justice shall rain down on my enemies! Why did- why did you have to take it there, Socks, of all places? What a- what a very specific circumstance that I'm in that I'm even able to- to recognize that that's what Socks is talking about at all. That I was just- I just happened to be there for Angry Birds movie night. <gasps> Cat house! I live here! Oh my god! <laughs> Perturbed cat. What do you want? I was in the middle of scampering. That's really good. Do I have this? Yeah, I do. I have this. Oh, that's handy. Yeah, I guess I should keep an eye out for more buttons because that's just like a new way to interact with things, you know? Like if Yippee City has stuff where you're like, you like revisit and then there's like a button, it's like, oh. And also these. The flower pots and the buttons are like of, of the same ilk. Uh, I know I saw a pot earlier and it's somewhere up the mountain. I just don't know like where specifically. Oh, there specifically. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Who? 
cat plant. What the? Evil gnome catnip. Guaranteed to make your cat scared or your money back. Hmm. I never noticed that there was a second box up here. I wonder what that's about. Um. I don't really see. Oh! I thought I could go down there. That's the long cat hole. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. This all seems normal to me. Let's, uh, let me narrow that down, though. 196. 89%. Uh... Oh, just this, just black cat, and then we're we're done with this area. It does feel good to clear him out though. Which means I think I know exactly what I'm looking for. Because I think previously, I think the way find everything worked in earlier versions is when there's a thing at the end of a button sequence, if you knew your way around it to, like, how to cheat it, then you just didn't have to do the buttons. Which I think actually is how I got the bow cat at, like, near the top of the mountain. But now, to open the cage, I would, for example, need to press the red button. So that I don't, like, skip this challenge. I mean, I can't really test the theory from here, but, I mean, it's pink blocks and it leads to a pink cage with bow in it. That is how that works. So not only does this answer the situation where I couldn't figure out what was going on with, like, the box with the bird in it, um, but I don't know what that is. I've never seen that in my life. So if I can find a button that, like, leads me up to it... Now we're getting somewhere. Hmm. Does it count as a Mount Duda area collectible? That'd be a good place to start. Let me see. Looks like a dog. If I can match that silhouette in the thing decks. I found... Quizzical Pooch. No, that counts as Thingsburg. So we'll keep that in mind. What things are in Mount Duda still? I found the bird. Two things. Waterfall Guy and Hairy Onion. Wait, I got both of these! Oh, maybe it doesn't count because it, like, disconnected? Okay, this is an easy way to 100% though. I'll try this waterfall, and if it's not that, then I'll go to the bigger waterfall. Seems like we're all kind of talking about the same stuff here, though. Oh! What the... Psst! Hey, up here. Hi! You're not here to collect me, are you? Oh, I see. Well, while you're here, check out my cup. It's an 8-ounce ceramic by Marmatastic Cuppies. They're super limited. I got the 10th ever made. I know. I'm pretty proud of it. Just look at it. It's perfect for hot chocolate. Coffee. Taste of Marmimo brand pure freaking orange juice. I love that one. Just don't ever, ever, ever use it for water. Water is the worst. My friends ditched me here a few weeks ago, and all I've had to drink is this stupid water, and I'm so sick of it. I can't leave because I will melt, so don't use my cup for water. I would respectfully ask that you would not use my cup at all. I'm sorry, that felt kind of mean. I mean, objectively, there wasn't anything mean about it. I said respectfully, but the way that came out felt like I was accusing you of something you didn't do, and I'm sorry. Do you ever apologize for things and then feel awkward right after because maybe it wasn't something you should have apologized for? So then you start backtracking and wishing you didn't apologize, but you had to in the moment because if you didn't, then you would have kept feeling like you were mean to them. So then you're just left in the social position where you're just standing out and you couldn't change anything regardless of whether or not you apologized? 
Wait, didn't you say you were going to collect me? Why do you collect things? I'm sorry, that felt accusatory. I mean, I collect things too, like my cup. So I guess it makes sense you collect. Wait, do you collect living beings like me? How do you even do that? I got this cup from an artisan cup maker that my best friend Lord Dungaworths introduced me to when I complained about not having a great cup to drink things out of. Oh yeah, Lord Dungaworths is kind of like the head of our friend group, the one that dished me here. So I guess Lord Dungaworth isn't really my friend anymore because I was pretty mean to them. But if Lord Dungaworth were to apologize, I wouldn't oppose to taking time to consider their apology because, you know, people change. But at the same time, maybe you shouldn't pursue furthering a friendship because one could consider Lord Dungaworth as a negative impact on my well-being. On account of them and other friends ditching me here, behind this waterfall. Did you just hear something? Like, water falling? I'm kind of avoiding water right now because I'm so sick of it. Did I tell you about that? Oh, right, I did. Sorry, it's just that I've been back here so long I've kind of had a lot of time to myself. And I have this thing where I just don't stop thinking of myself and continuing this long, long, continuous internal dialogue with myself. Kind of like a waterfall. And that was getting kind of dry and I need to conserve moisture because I refuse to drink water, so I guess I'll see you around. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, by the way, just because I'm not going to be able to stop thinking about once our conversation is over didn't mean to say sorry earlier. Like, not the times I apologized for it, but the most recent one. I forgot what it was for, but I know that I said it, and it's just going to bother me if I don't say I didn't mean it. You know how it is. Thanks for listening to me. I hope we get you to hear some of your- I hope we get to hear some stories from you soon. Like, next time you come back and all. Is it too soon to consider you my new best friend? Because I've just had so much fun talking with you, and you've given me joy in moments of darkness, like right now since my friends ditched me behind this waterfall, but you haven't left yet, and that fills you with happiness. Wait. I hope I wasn't moving too quickly. You know, because some people are kind of overbearing when you first meet them, and I don't want to present myself that way towards you all at all or anything. Look, for both of our sakes, and just so I don't apologize to you again, I'm going to just continue as if I didn't do something wrong. Because even though my subconscious is screaming at me that I did, I probably didn't, so let's just forget I said that. Wait, if you collect me, does that mean I'll get to go with you on adventures for the rest of our lives until one of us dies? That sounds like something best friends would do. Sorry, that's a bit morbid. Not to scope into our deaths immediately or anything like that. Just looking at the horizon, you know. Well, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Collect me! Waterfall guy. Do not interrupt! <laughs> I am filled with immense joy. Thanks for collecting me. It's beautiful. I love that find everything as a game. You, you really just do like stumble into shit like that. In the most unlikely of places. Alright. I need to very carefully and deftly avoid invoking the wrath of the pogfish. Of, of Port Knight. I don't want to make any fish mad, alright? That's how I see it. And a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Mount Duda is done. Show me my things. Come on. I have to stop moving. Okay, so we're not at less than 20 things left, but 90% is pretty good. There's more stuff in What's It Woods, apparently. Yeah, I want to go find some more of these cubed, imprisoned creatures. There's one in Thingsburg and one in Ballyhoo Bluffs. And I wouldn't have known what to do with them if I found them before, but now there's, like, hope. So yeah, I'll just, like, find a button. See what happens. Probably, like, a high place in Thingsburg, I suppose. Is a basketball! Hold the phone. Do I have to shoot it from here? Oh, it's bouncy though. Whoa! <laughs> First of all, excellent shot. Second of all, excellent dog. Sports dog. This must be a three pointer dog. Do you literally only get that if you manage to make that shot? God, that's so good. I like the hills here. The slopes. It's nice. So if there's one more thing to interact with and it's not... 
the thing floating above Thingsburg. Oh my god. Then who are we talking about here? There's another cat unaccounted for. It could be hiding in these. You never know now. They put anything in them these days. Uh, okay. I mean, I already did that. Unless, I mean, if they put a new sub-area thing in the John Gamer Fries area, then I don't know. Did I get this one already? This might be like a separate pot. I don't remember having done this one. Wait a second. What do we have here? Oh yeah. No way am I messing with seeds. See, this one's nice. It's a nice little quiz that takes you through all the areas you know and love. Uh-oh. What did I miss? Oh, it just keeps going, I guess. Whoops. I thought it was like the, the green one that I found before that I really didn't like in, um, what's it, Woods? Where, like, I didn't go, like, all the way up or some, like, dumb shit like that. Um, no, this one's normal, though. Just these two. Uh oh. Please. I can't let it end here. Whew. Wow! I always forget that Tyler has such like a crazy taste in cats. Like they always have so many pictures of them. And it it is clearly showing here. Um but with that, I think that is another area 100% of that is officially 200 things. And if I go to Pawbean Park, hide found, we're done here. So I think all that's left, Yippee City, What's It Woods, Gaming Yard, Thingsburg. And in Ballyhoo Bluffs. Yeah, wasn't I looking like looking for buttons here or something? I don't... I still don't see anything that fits that description. Outside of- I found a basketball, but that was it. Uh, there's other, like, high up places I haven't been to, though. I need more exploring. Oh! Bingo. Oh, cool! These are some cute clouds. I like the colors. Oh, that's a long timer, though. I'm gonna have to restart that. If you slam the button an additional time, does it, like, reset the sequence, or do you have to wait for it to deplete? No, you gotta wait. It's a good way to scope out what remains, though. Oh, they're bouncy! Oh! Jeez. This is involved. You, oh my god. <laughs> Everyone thinks you're so weird. No, I'm normal, I promise. What happens if I do just like, locations things, Berg? How's that looking? There's just one thing left, tiger poster. Okay, I thought I had like way more to do here for whatever reason. Oh, that makes a little ramp show up. I remember that being like a like a really old, like unreleased build of Find Everything. I thought they just like took it out, but that's cool. Um, I'll check for a poster in here. A ti I feel like, you know, you'd like work out with a tiger poster, maybe. Wow, look at all the shiny weights up here now. Now that I've unlocked all the things. Um, okay. 
I don't think there's a tiger poster here. It could also be, though, that there is, like, a lot more indoor areas that I'm allowed to explore. So I'll start looking around for more of those, because I feel like I saw, like, an arrow between- Yeah, this! What's in here? Are you winning? Hi, Tyler! Uh, I have less than 20 things left, and I'm looking for a tiger poster right now. I'm, like, slowly but surely 100%ing my areas. And once I find the tiger poster, I'm done with things, bro, but I have no idea where to look. I thought maybe the gym lobby, but it wasn't in there. And I have a sneaking feeling that it's in one of the specific, like, test rooms. And I'm like, man, I don't want to go back and do that right now. Um, I figured out how to free animals from cages, so that's, like, kind of cool. Um, I found Quizzical Dog. You actually saw the tiger poster early in stream on a TV. <gasps> oh, is it, um... In the Roblox house? The happy home? Where is that? That's Spawn Hill. And then also, did, I think there's like one more thing in the juice bar that maybe I didn't find. It's called like, like a sibling or something. Oh. This? Free poster. <gasps> Call 9119! Motherfucker. That is so sneaky! And also I got a really cool basketball shot. You really should have seen it. I didn't make that connection at all. That's crazy. Siplet is behind the bars in Ballyhoo. Yes. What do we got? Thank you for calling the Freak's Tiger Poster Hotline. Please wait while we validate your request. Our ad tracking program has located your address. Would you like free shipping or ungodly expensive quick shipping? What? You have chosen ungodly expensive quick shipping. So, so quick it's probably unethical. So expensive you'll probably regret it. Guaranteed! Please give us 1 to 10 business seconds to process your delivery. Your package has been delivered to Happy Home in Thingsburg. We have entered the house without your consent and set up the poster for you. If you notice the feeling of being watched tonight, simply ignore it. Side effects will disappear after a few days. Please enjoy your educational and free tiger poster. I like the little, like, bits of dust in the air. It's a good particle. I like how they... They bark and honk. I wish this guy came back. I want more secrets. That was a good character. I found the ramp, finally. Wow! That's crazy. Now you can visit steamy jungles, grassy plains, and the dark depths of the ocean, all through the captivating and colorful tiger poster. Not quite exactly as advertised, is it? Um, okay, 202. Locations, Thingsburg, we're done. So we got What's It Woods, Yemim Yard, Ballyhoo Bluffs, and I guess a little bit of Yippie Sippy, and I guess that's it. We're getting somewhere. And of course the credits house, but we'll save that for the very end, like I said. Um, it seems like I can pretty readily 100% Ballyhoo with the information that I have now. Both knowing about the blocks and also about... Um, Ooh. Behind bars. Oh my god, the rock, paper, scissors. The less we discuss that, the better. Behind bars, you say? Bars near the juice bars, maybe? Probably not. I remember seeing somebody. I feel like I already opened them. Isn't, like, along this wall or something, there's, like, a bunch of, like, caves you can go to? Does this branch off or fork in any way? I don't think so. I'll get the bird first. Because, yeah, I did find a blue button. I didn't even, like, realize it was, like, leading me to a thing. Thought it was, just, like, a fun way to get around. 
So that's where the USB is. But then this keeps going. I guess... I could start from, like, the bird and work backwards. I could get, like, a, like a good angle there, maybe. Could figure out what's going on up here one day. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here it is. Gotcha. Oh, you turn. Yeah, as it keeps going is, is my surprise to me. And, ugh, bam. You've been rate limited. <laughs> Wait, this isn't supposed to be Elon Musk? <laughs> I'm sure there's some goofy-ass photo where he really is dressed like that. Okay, so then, and then I need Siplet. Wait, these are bars! It's Siplet! Okay, well now all I need to do is find a button. When am I gonna do that? Wait a second. I think I might have also figured this out too. Completely accidentally. Because didn't I like open up bars down here? Uh, I don't know. No, you're normal. You're not imprisoned. If anything, you're kind of cute. Huh. I mean, I've never met a pair of bars whose associated button is that ever that far away, so... Let's scope it out here. Hold on, have I been on top of that structure? That could be a start. Oh god. Oh, let's get this guy out of here already. Hold the phone, what do we got here? Oh. Just a leaf? Okay. Really? No bars? Nothing? No button for the bars? This feels like such a likely location in my eyes. It's not like on a ceiling of anything, is it? Button on ceiling? They wouldn't do that. Maybe I just gotta follow this or something. I don't know, this seems like normal. God, what a freak. Maybe the bars, maybe the secret here is that, like, the button is behind the bars. So trying to open them and then using that is, like, my theory of how to get in. Like, I'm, I could be going about this the wrong way entirely. Maybe I open one of these guys up and there's, like, a hole in the side. Nothing like that that I see yet. like, kind of try to piece together the- wait a second! You. Yes! Let it into your home now! Alright, locations. Ballyhoo, hide found. Okay, there's one more. There's a boar vessel. I've never seen that thing in my life and I don't know where to look. Um, I don't think I've explored- oh, there it is. Oh, this bit with the spikes, and then you do this? Okay, not bad at all. You better not be Boar Vessel 500 to 600 BC at Trusen Ceramic when I get here. I already did this. Okay, Bally, who is done? So I think I have, weirdly enough, a few things left in... What is it now? What's it, Woods? Yeah. Awesome Pumpkin, Drysellium, and Termite. Ah, 
how much did this place really get changed? There's like layers in this zone too. Look at there's like under spots. Well, okay, if I were looking for a termite, I would probably go where there's like lots of wood, but there's a forest, so there's kind of wood everywhere. Unless the termite's like outside of a house. Wait a second. I haven't done sparkly button. Sparkly button is always the answer. When in doubt, it's always these things. What the? Oh my cubes! I don't have time to think. I just have to get more. Phew! Wow! Yes! I feel like there's definitely been some point in my life where I definitely like made a jack-o'-lantern that looked like this. I bet this would make an epic pumpkin pie. Yeah, do you guys call it the awesome face or the epic face? Answer carefully because there is a right answer, and if you answer wrong, I will judge you. Look at this, there's still cubes. What is this place? They're not like stars. Like, I can't pick them up, like, normal either. There's a couple of things that have gone wrong here. Uh, oh, wait, there's another button here. What the- Pfft. Don't talk to me till I've had my sawdust. <laughs> Okay, well that already leaves one left. I didn't realize that there was like rollover noises when you put the mouse over that. I like it. Uh, what's it woods? Okay. Huh. Well, there's mushrooms everywhere in this place. This is no more helpful than my, my wood tip. But I gotta keep it fresh. I gotta look in places that I haven't been. So this can't just spawn a hill again. This is this is too far. Thank God, Petito Quack Quack is still back here. In retrospect, this feels like such such like a weird thing to have as a thing and find everything. Like everything else is like an illustration or like there's like one or two things that are like a photograph, but are still like at the very least like PNGs. Wait a second, what is this? Huh? What is this? Ball that makes you fast? For what purpose? I made it for a jack-o'-lantern last year. Oh, that's awesome. It, it, it definitely does like roll back around to being cool once you reach a certain threshold. And you're definitely there, Tyler. Whoa! The little little popcorn sounds you get for this. For the invisible stars are really satisfying. And it really pleased me. Wait, that's the ball from the dump? Oh, well, that's really funny. Wait, there it is! I've got you now. <gasps> Come on. Yes! Hi. Cool. And so that's the last thing here, right? Yup. So everything that I'm missing can now fit on one page. Um, let me see Yum Yum Yard. There's like a, a surprising number. Wow, five things here that I'm still missing. That's almost half of everything that's left. I think that's the next spot I want to set off for because I haven't just I just haven't visited that at all. I love some of the spaces like this too, where you've like kind of shuffled some of the building things to make like the flow through the town a little easier. Oh, you can't grind on this? Uh, I better see that fixed in, in 0.3.0. God, this sign looks so good. Yeah, speaking of buildings that have been moved, Yummy Yummy Yard is the place to be. Wait a second. Oh, what? 
One, two, three, four, five. Is there like a rainbow building? What is that telling me about? Oh, <gasps> you. Okay. <gasps> Something's happening. Two thousand four MSN emoji. What's good, Yippee City? Hey, Pac-Man. What's up? Can you put crack and find everything. Where is the Yangum Yard? It like, used to be here-ish, but now it's like more park area. And I still have not found that fourth vending machine. It could be near this stuff though, right? Like in this kind of corner. Near the Bob's Burgers. I don't know. Actually, wait. No, that's just like a ramp. For some reason, seeing this reminds me a lot of um, RA3. Like, there's that beta hub where there's like a ramp that you go down there and there's like a racetrack. That's my theory for what is going to be found there. We already put crack and find everything. That's why you're still playing. But what happens when it's all gone? Alright. I guess I could have just used the my, my warp drive, but... I found some things on the way. Whoa, do the cookies always have like cool floating? Like that? Alright, what's missing here? Is there like a like a appreciably new area? Or okay, yeah, there's there's new remix challenges. So where am I gonna find a seed? Do I have to like go to the top of the mountain and like bring it down as an inversion of what oh no, it's just right here. I guess I do prefer this. Oh, it's gonna make me throw it though? Whew. Oh, it's like purple soil. Oh, Chaotic Bean. It's frenzy time! Also, you should play Chaotic Bean Simulator. This is a thing. Like, is there anything new, for example, on Mount Jaleste? Do I need to come back here? Berry jelly, grape jelly, maybe. Because the jellies, those are like the, the pride flags, right? New sexualities and gender identities got patched in. Wait, literally! Tastes like love. Okay, well I'm still missing one then. What do we got? Find every one. Two amount Gelest, two in chocolate area. Cool. Oh wow! Oh no, I already had this one. I just I just say that whenever I see the, the non-binary flag. Uh is that the one that I don't have? The bisexual one? Hold on. I'm gonna go back to Yummy Yum Yara, but I'm gonna like not hide found so I can see if I have it. Layered jelly. So I do already have that one. Hmm. Well I guess if I climb to the top either way, I will be able to just like get a good view of places that I could still go to.
They're gonna make my ass do the Mount Geleste B-sides. Uh, no, this seems okay. There's nothing scary up here. Wait a second. Hello? Wait. Who are you? Grape jelly! Tastes like pride. I finally collected them all. Yeah, nice try. I don't need the RA1 bridges. Hmm. Oh, this is weird though, that the oscillation doesn't affect the player. I know that there's like, always been window skips like this that you can do. Is that, like, no, I've done this before. What's like new? What's like a new place I can visit? I think I'm just doing stuff backwards right now. But I don't remember there being like green gems either! That's like a normal chocolate chip. I have that. Forgot to oscillate the hitbox for that one. Oh, okay. So it's like supposed to be normal. Uh, this I just did. I'm gonna do it like forwards. I think I do remember, though, that, that somewhere in this river, there is, like, a place where you can branch off, and it does lead to, like, an empty spot. And I'm guessing, if I, ha if I had to guess, it's been filled. And my second guess is that it's also just more of these. Oh, God. Oh, God. <gasps> oh, this one's gonna get weird, though, because there's, like, timing involved. Like, the cycles of the platforms. That's gonna get rough. Oh, and especially because as you explore backwards through the level, you're gonna start touching checkpoints. I like this. This is very Mario Sunshiny. Reminds me a lot of um, when Gooper Blooper pees in the water. But like you, you lose your place that would let you like retry that challenge quickly enough. Yeah, this is really disorienting. So every time I fail the challenge, I have to do all this? Oh god. Oh. Well, you know what I mean, because there's, like, the grates in Rico Harbor around the spot where you're, like, supposed to, um... Oh, God. It's where Episode 2 takes place, the, the gooper, the, the blooper surfing safari. Oh, I guess that's new. Bittersweet. And when gooper blooper is there, there's, like, he pees in the water. That's better. Oh yeah. Wow. Oh, this one's like a lot. God, this fucking thing. Infinite chocolate. How has nobody ever tried this? 213. Fucking balding eagle. So the only one I'm missing is candy mascot. So I'm guessing that's in the gumball zone, maybe? Because I wasn't... I sure wasn't told three in any area, so it's probably some place I haven't been yet. I, 
could have sworn you could like bounce off of those. Have I been here? Oh yeah. The dark chocolate was just a multi-part that got added. Oh! So that's not the second thing in the chocolate area. I gotcha. Is is my theory then about the oh I like how you can like subtly see like there's like marks in the icing. Where the balls roll. It's cute. It's been disturbed. <laughs> but I was talking about some sort of mysterious area. where you come through the first go around. Man, I don't know where it was, but I know what I saw, dude. Forks off is something or other. Oh yeah, this! And that's exactly where it is! Oh my god. Oh my god, the eyes! Candy mascot, the final boss of capitalism. Oh. I guess it was like a whole thing for like getting in here like in our normal way. Unless this is the exit. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, yeah, it connects to all this. Okay. Uh, oh, I think that's yummy yum. You're done then, isn't it? Oh, I'm dead. Hide found though? Yes! Which means it's back to Yippie City. And I've got Thingsburg done too, right? Uh, 97%. Man, that's crazy. Nope, nothing in Thingsburg. Oh my god. I didn't see that there was like a, like a symbol for this. Accidents! What's the- It's the only category for accidents! <laughs> I mean, if I just do this... Yippee City, Yippee City, Yippee City, Spawn Hill, Yippee City, Training Gym. Training Gym?! Well, it's good to know that my Tiger Poster, if I did want to pursue that... It would have been like specified for me. The account says its own area outside of Thingsburg. It's the only accident in Thingsburg. Oh, is that true? Hold on. Oh, there's Wheezy and there's Pink Stain. Oh my god. Why is Wheezy an accident? Let's see. If there's not a punching bag in here, oh no, we're good. Oh, you have to like dislodge it? Hold on, I like this. You gotta like make it hit a certain velocity or something. Or is there a thing at the top that you can break it off from? This looks successful to me. Oh, or just you hit it a number of times. Sandbag. When it comes to taking a beating, this thing wins no contest! Dude! Five things left. Man, I've gotta find that damn vending machine already. Is it on a roof? By Timmy H4. Okay, there's this. Didn't there used to be like another like building that you could like flip down the wall, or is that gone? Oh, Pink Stain is construction zone. Is that true? Because it says Yippee City, and it doesn't say... Like, Construction Zone has its own warp drive, right? Yeah, it does. I think that one might be just be, like, miscategorized. Last vending machine is near a very tall building. Pink stain. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I mean it might have something to do with like this, uh, this garage. I saw that there was like a key thing and I couldn't figure out how to get in. Is it related to that at all or? Oh, there's pink up here. Hold on. Oh, but pink stain has to do with, that's um like the sub area I was in from the jelly factory. Is it in there? Nah, the garage isn't done, it relates to the crane. The crane? I know a thing or two about the crane. And it's in the accidents category? Oh no. <laughs> no! Why do I have to be the one responsible for this with my own two hands? Oh. <laughs> oh. I guess that's why you need a license to operate a crane. Fucking look at it, dude. It's got like a, like a substance to it. It's got like chunks. Near a tall building though, that could be a couple of things. Oh my God, the speed on that. Might be a sky needle. Oh, over here. I was just thinking I hadn't been in this little alleyway yet. What? Oh! God damn it. <laughs> Ugh, there's always a catch with free soda. It's been one of my favorite developing find everything jokes. How many places you've found to express your love for the, the Roblox rocket launcher sound and behavior. It's so special. I like these green tunnels too. All right, so what else is missing? I think there's only like two or three things left now, right? Three. Hide found. So Chalk Hearts, there's two in Yippie City and then it's just credits. Um, Scuzz Floppy Ear. I'm not sure where I'd find either of these. Oh, wait a second. Hold on, hold on. What's this? Oh, it's normal. I was looking for that cave thing I was just mentioning. None of these doors are real. What about you? Have you been in here? This is where Wheezy is. Wheezy used to be in like a high up place. So I, got, I was a little like, unsure. Surprised you haven't been there somehow? Is it like in an indoor area? Or is it somewhere out here? Is it the sun? I wanted to go there earlier, but it doesn't seem like there's like a good route to finding it. I'm having a good time with this movement though. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't really see any path to that. It doesn't really make much sense. I don't think I'm... I'm not really barking up the right tree. Yeah, because it, it takes you up here. I did that. It's when they dump a Yippie City in a, in a lower alley. Oh, is it like the, the waste treatment facility? I know exactly where that is. Oh, yeah, didn't you guys like forget to put a thing in a certain spot? You might have come back to add that later, like after I had already 100%ed my session. Yeah, the dump. Oh, brother. I can recover? I can cast the spell! Okay, phew. Wait, oh, there it is! Up there! Up there! Well, now how am I going to go backwards? As long as I can grab one of these sponges, I'll be able to use it to, like, re recharge my jumping. And also... I don't know. Can I do it off of this? No. No way, no how. Maybe we'll go like a little further down the path here. Because I'll get higher up that way. Oh yeah, it looks like you do it from here actually. This is the intentional route. Then I do this. Chirpies. Oh my god. Nice! Okay. Back on track. one of these that's sitting like really close by a fire. Like it was like definitely meant to be incinerated and it just wasn't. God, I want to know who made this mesh when I get all four of them. Chirpy's here. <laughs> oh! Rats. Man, this is still such a great sub area, though. Just like these three elements constantly interweaving. And the moment to moment decision making feels great. This toy was recalled because it liked biting fingers. Oh, I guess it's meant to be a Furby. I thought it was like an Angry Birds parody because it like looks like that. Oh my god. Uh, I guess I don't have to finish this sequence if I don't want to. What's uh, what's the last thing? I did vending machine, I did chirpies. Scuzz floppy ear? Oh, you know what? If that's meant to be like Buzz Lightyear and we're in the incinerator, that might also be down here. Right? Ending of Toy Story 3. That is what's happening! You guys just forgot to put the things in here. Oh my god. Do I talk to you? No, I just get it. 
This is the worst toy I've ever seen. Well, that explains why I was searching a high and low and just didn't find it. I assumed I'd already just done everything there is to do. I like the extra little trash particles that come out of these ones. And we're out of here. Is that it? Is that find everything for tonight? All I have to do is go to the credits. Man, what an update. That was so many things to find. Oh my god, the, the fucking noob area from the dump. Man. There were so many hilarious little things I found the whole way through. I can't believe that you put this part of the game. This felt like it was made for me. The dump music is so good too. It really is crazy that like, this is what you guys are regarding as 0 0.2.0. Cause it, it really feels like so complete, even the way it is now. All the little things you can do and find. Yeah, the Arlo Blaster. His real beating heart. It's kind of uncanny if you think about it. Okay, I'm going I'm going to the spawn hill though. I've been dashing between the major areas so often I've forgotten what was at the, the center of it all, which is love and spawn hill. This is a great mesh for the theater building as well. Lots of um like askew proportions that are just so much fun to look at. My god, the posters. If I happened to make a, an image that was like, <laughs> that was like Finder Emblem, what do you think of that? Anyways, welcome back to this. Welcome back to this great list of names. Uh, perhaps even more impressive than it was at the very beginning. I cannot like walk away and like do fidgeting while I watch this scroll by because I'm going to lose the hearts again. Okay. It's like the Undertale credits. Um. Yeah, the entire time I was on vacation, I was, like, thinking about this update. I'm like, oh, man, I can't wait to play it when I get back. And, uh, man, it really was worth the wait. Um, wait, what's this? Oh! Coming out from behind the screen. This is, um... Every time I get the chance to stop by this, it's just such a stunning labor of love. Um... Yeah, dude, Sox's Observatory. Nothing says we love our players like a mandatory credit sequence. And now I take my Arlo Blaster and I explode the screen and I go behind and I find the secret post-credits boss. Right? And I find Flowey and Flowey's like, actually, don't find everything. Right? You got like little cityscapes on the wall. Like even just like this one little zone. It's got like so many fun details in it. It's a good hangout place. Uh, and I can't wait to see what you guys do next for the update because um, those sewers still aren't in the game yet. That coastal city that looks so cool. It would be so awesome if it was put in the game. But uh, yeah, it, it's so cool that like, That everybody working on this individually has their own history with adventure games and their own background with making stuff individually and the fact that this like dream team has like been assembled and is making something cool uh in like in like modern roblox you know like the adventure scene just is like kind of quiet right now and this is such like like a beautiful return to form it feels so modern there's gonna be so many people who like don't even know anything about the old like adventure games in roblox who are like, gonna be, like playing this and having a good time and like what the fuck yeah, don't talk to this guy. <laughs> um, but it's exciting. It's an exciting moment for Roblox and for my friends and me having them. Uh, but as for the stream, I think that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the stream, you can follow me here on Twitch or on YouTube uh, at the Full Galaxy where all the VODs are plus highlights and more. You can also subscribe to me right here on Twitch if you particularly enjoyed the stream. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, Pillowfort, Backlogs, co-host, and Discord. 
There is a Discord server where there are all sorts of channels for you guys to hang out in both on and off stream. And if any of that interests you, you can check out the links to all that in the Twitch cards below if you're watching this live or in the YouTube description if you're watching the VOD. And if you want to play this game, go to findeverything.com. And if you want to give the, these guys tips of Robux, then you should do that too. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night.